Hey. Woo! All right. Ooh. Well, welcome yeah. everyone to Smashy York February Edition 2021. Uh, you know, as everyone knows, so why the you pandemic is still going, but you know, the grinding for Smash doesn't stop there. So we're still gonna host these events online, and this is the second, actually, I believe the, the third one, or for monthly uh, tournaments. And to kickstart, we're gonna do Winner's Run one now. And yes, sir. And who's hey, gonna Jeff, be our better? To the Discord. Thank you. All right. I did. Appreciate you. We're gonna have Marion versus Joe Store for round one. Jonathan. 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 Wait, that, that's not Joe Store. Just, just Jonathan. It's not. Just me, Jonathan. No. Wait, wait, hold up. We have a cluster around here. <laughs> there could be more than one Jonathan. Not even. No, my no, you're a cap. No, you're a cap. <laughs> more than one Jonathan. I only know one, and that's the president of the YU Smash Club, Joe Store, the Wolf Mane. Anyone else is doesn't exist to me. I'm sorry. Or maybe not. You know, may maybe Jonathan will come up and say, "Hey, I also I also exist." So maybe, <laughs> that's how maybe I'm just trying to have two runs. Oh wait, I got two lives. Uh, no sir is in the. He fights a winner of another set. Shit, I, I got, got two here. lives. Wow. All right, uh, right now we're just waiting for the competitor to arrive to the arena. As we all know, Smash Online can be sometimes a bit iffy, but the cool thing is that this is a Ontario only I get, event. I get to play, play my set of box right now. Sorry, you mean to talk with you? I get to play my set of box and come back. Yeah. So I just get over with. Okay, I'll be back. And this is why I come to set of box bed, so we can always have a commentator in the booth. But as I was saying, uh, the thing about uh, Smash Online tournaments is that sometimes it can be a bit iffy due to the poor netcode the game has. So for that reason, we're gonna have we, this term is Ontario only. So there should not be a lot of a, uh, you know, a Ooh, lot of lag. Yeah, there should, there, there should not be a lot of lag. Yeah, there should be very little. I want to say I played earlier against Jonathan Joster and Marion. They were not lagging. I can confirm. They were not laggers. Yes, sir. We got land. Land is very important for online tournaments too. It makes it so that you have a consistent connection between. It's both kind players. of required, in my opinion. If you um, ask me no, personally, no, it's, it's it's not required because sometimes you can have a smooth connection on on Wi-Fi too. Yeah, but that required that also requires you to have like a like a, a like way better than average connection as well. Yeah, like that's the average true. person. The average person is it's not gonna have like that smooth of connection. That's true. I've entered a Wi-Fi tournament where I was on Wi-Fi and nobody lag checked me because I was just, my connection was very good. I didn't even I realize that I was like on, on Wi-Fi. And other times I it's just do. been absolutely terrible and just unplayable. Mm -hmm. I agree. Hi. Well, uh, who do we have for, do we know whose character is Jonathan gonna go? I do not. Terry, okay. Another Terry player, a very popular pick for Wi Fi tourneys. Uh, there we go. Just we because. Get... Yep. I can peep the Smash GG page to see who everyone's playing. So uh, yes, play... we're the mod. Marion's going uh, Greninja, Jonathan's going Terry, and they're starting on Battlefield. I can tell you that already. All right. Most people are checked in. The only one that's not checked in is one solo. Yeah, guys, please. If you guys are participating in tournaments, uh, I know you guys want to follow the stream and stuff. Just leave it in the background and just go play in your set, please. All right? Please. It's always the funniest thing about uh, online tournaments, right? Just, just, just the fact they actually people take longer. You. Yeah, they, they take longer longer than the setup than, than offline tourneys, even though you have way more setups. But yeah, but that's because people just DQ, or like they just don't show up. So you just end up winning there. Like, as opposed to offline, it, it, you know during the venue or not. You just go yell, hey, it's Bob, the the, the cherry man here. You know, and then, they, and then you call for Bob, calling once, calling one, twice, and then he's not there. You just DQ, you just DQ his ass right there. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's, that's one good thing oh, about online tournaments is that you have to commit once you enter. Yeah, I was about to say, that looks like a very funny Greninja right there. Uh, 
Uh, uh, Marion right, right here just did an error. He was supposed to go Greninja, not Palutena, and that's why they're gonna restart. Where's the bait? It's in mind games, actually, you know? Like, like the finger bad, it's like, you know, the finger new. Okay. It's like, yeah, you know, I'm so new to the game, I forgot to choose a proper character, you know? <laughs> right? Like, look, I was playing Palu, I got carried. True. Wait, was Palu... Yeah, Palu was added in Smash 4, so both Smash 4 characters. Yeah, they're, they're both right next to each other in it, and the pattern just like scream. I understand the, the, the mistake of that, even then. You know, I think it's all my game. I think he's about to show us something nasty. Oh, we're about to get ready. You're running it. Yes, sir. Three, yes. Two, one, and here is the first go. set. Honestly, I... I'm very interested to see what this stair is gonna do. Like, oh, jab. Oh, mess up his combos. I'm gonna start. Wait, are All you right. Discord? I'm watching on Twitch. Okay. Let me see. It says that the stream's paused on Discord. Scuff, a scuff stream. There go, there it's, it's, it's not, it's not, it's not a why you monthly with fun scuff stream. All right, so great job. Okay, I was well, about to say yeah. Marion. First stock going to Marion. Honestly, that's one of the best times to kill Terry just before he, he like he gets to go, right? Like, or or just when he gets to go. Those are the best time. Yeah, exactly. Like, you don't want him to be on stage with go. Yeah, that's the, like voids right there. Oh, oh unfortunately, but another stock to, to marry. Yeah, I mean this looks like a quick uh, 3-0. If I were Jennifer around here, I would just yeah, I would just see what works, what doesn't work, you know. See what what you, what can you do for to bring it bring it out oh. for next game. But that's it. Oh no, Mary, no, oh, no chill. Almost, almost got one stock. Mary, Mary chill. At the last one. Just chill. <laughs> no, it was a three stock. Yeah, it was almost it was almost not. But Marion was like on his way to the blast zone. Oh. I mean you gotta chill, okay? <laughs> Marion just going all in that match. Uh, I suppose he just really wants some money. My man my man playing like he, he needs a paycheck, you know? Yeah. <laughs> He's on his way. He's on his way. He you gotta pay those loans, man. Actually it's not gonna cover the loans at all, but <laughs> it, it <laughs> will cover like money. But it will cover, you know, like a few trips to McDonald's. Yeah, may maybe a trip to McDonald's. You get a Big Mac combo. Yeah, yeah, maybe, maybe he's trying to get a, the, a new game. You know, I mean, if you if you do get first place, uh, uh, Joe, do you mind reminding us what what are, like what are your prizes? What are your prizes? Well, if you're a York student, you get access to the York U student specific prizing, which is $100 in gift cards. And top placing York student will get $50 in gift cards. Second and third will get $25 each. And also, there's an additional $30 on top of that that goes to anyone. Uh, it's up for grabs for anyone. And that goes $15, $10, and $5 for first, second, and third place. All right. So you're saying that if you if you were to get first, you would get a hundred oh, sixty five dollars then? Yes, sixty five dollars. That's the max. But there can still be a first place that makes. It, it's it's not only first place. Like it's first York yep. student. So if a York student gets first place, then they're sixty five dollars. I agree. Uh, the one thing I'm, not, I'm noticing right now is that. Yeah, so winners of last time were first place for our last monthly for January were were Jams at first place. Yes. Then we had a Gamer at second place, and then we had Venomtime at third place. The thing is that Venomtime was the only jerk student, uh, so he got the full uh, fifty dollars. If I remember correctly, yeah. right? Yeah. He got the full fifty dollars. Yeah, but he only got five dollars since he only extra since he only got third place. So 55 as opposed to uh, 65, which is still pretty good. That's like, yep. like you know, three whole trips to McDonald's. Yeah, and now I'm getting a uh, six tails on comp here. Hello yeah, please there. give me someone else. I'm just kidding. I love you, Joe. One thing though, I'm noticing that I really like the going back to the match finally. Like as just we're talking, like like Jennifer's making quite a comeback. It's way yeah, he's different. Definitely like, playing a lot stronger in game one. Yeah. 
finding his footing. He, yeah, he, 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 his final way to get around the pressure Marin is just like put him down. Oh, missing the input right there. Like he did jump to, like so he didn't air to the other way, so he was unable to catch Marion. Marion's oh, definitely a character that, put, that puts on a lot of pressure when you're getting comboed. It's like very hard to figure out where you're supposed to go. Yeah. Oh, oh. Very weird edge guard by Marion. Okay. Very okay. Weird. Okay. Which does not pay out at all. It does not pay off at all because Jonathan just aware of it. He just like drifts back. Oh, oh. our guy's the wrong way. Maybe he's bait. It was a bait? It was all a bait because Marin counter. Maybe he knew all along, you know, he 100% knew he was gonna counter, right? 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 Exactly. Exactly. It's all mine. That should not do it. Terry is quite a heavy. Alright, I believe Jonathan, it's always like, you know, oh, coming down with a hit. Oh! Waiting for, the counter, oh waiting for the counter that time. Waiting for the counter. Oh, that's Ooh. it. What's your wall? Hold There's up. One game going to Jonathan. Good stuff. Jonathan! Okay. You really up at the end of there. Yeah, he did. So that once once Marion had that SD, he picked up momentum. He's doing very good. Yeah, he did not. He did not let the momentum get out. Landing, landing all his go moves. Two. All right, testing, testing, testing. Hello, everybody. Hello. Continuing to talk to balance audio. Hello, hello, hello. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. Awesome. <clears throat> Yeah, hey all. Just got back from work. Ready to commentate some Hi. Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Always <laughs> ready. Always on the ball. <laughs> Been a bad day, but you know what? That's not what matters. <laughs> bad day. What matters is the gameplay today. I'm, I'm ready to see some, some primo gameplay from all of our. This is a highlights today. This is a prime highlights. I'm ready to play. Prime highlights, yeah. I'm super ready to play. I am excited to see you play, Joe. <laughs> Hopefully, you I, I am not. I think oh. I need to make it a bit in bracket before we see that. You're right. You know what? I in 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 preparation, I've been a uh, I've been trying to pick up a little bit of ultimate again, just because you know. And I think I, I think I just gotta just gotta do it. You know. I think I yeah. think too much it's, playing this. It's game. just something you just gotta dive into. Yeah. Yeah, you don't have to think too much about things, man. Like, at first, I think, yeah, like, I, it, think I, I force it a little bit too much here. Mm, it takes it takes a while for like for for thinking to actually like like proper thinking to actually matter in this game. Like it takes a while. Like uh like just muscle memory things are more important in this game. Like at first, the, at first, always. Mm -hmm. And I then, was and then fundamentals you, carrying over would be better just to work oh, on that. Yeah, yeah, like fundamentals, your autopilot, those, those are the things that matter the most at first. And then that's when, you, uh, after like a bit, after you get more comfortable with your character and like what you're doing, then that's when you start doing like getting more into the thinking side of things. Oh, like, oh, how I'm gonna properly outplay my opponent and stuff. And speaking of outplaying the opponent, Jonathan, last game, just <laughs> bringing <laughs> one one. Streams paused. Okay, we're still waiting on them to ban. Looks like they're going battlefield this time. I'm assuming they're both going to be playing the same characters. We'll see. Terry and Greninja, yeah. yeah. They both look like they're both comfortable. Although I would argue that Jonathan is a bit, uh, he's still a bit too trigger happy. Like whenever he was landing, like he knew how to get around the pressure, which is what the most important thing, which is like grind him the win. But you need to be able to also like get, be comfortable with confirms, which I don't think he's still yet, you know? Like he's really good at landing those like hurt, like those raw hits. Uh, he needs he needs to also land the confirms something that you know Terry's so scary about. So scary yeah. about Terry. I was thinking where, where he falls apart the most is when Marion gets a hit and he's comboing Jonathan into just a lot of other stuff. It's hard to get out of yeah. that. I think it's like where we're having the most Like see, like instead of going there for like the, like the up throw up air confirm, mm. nice parry though. Hold up. Yeah, very nice parry. That's really he. He really seems to be just playing center stage like usual, yeah. like pure, pure, neutral, trying to control stage, and just getting those raw oh, hits. And, 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 and they just just burn out close to say that just neutral. Yeah, just going, going Sorry, I don't know what that is. Burn out close to neutral. Yeah. It is now. It is now time for the go sauce, and oh. I think he's just oh no text, no text, no text. Unfortunately, this is a no text zone. 
Just raw jab. Just jab into burn knuckle. That it's that's not a true combo. That's, I want to make yeah. it clear. That's not a real thing. But oh, so, that's pretty really unexpected. But it's not Marianne. expected. Yeah, therefore, it works. Marion with the really nice execution there, pulling the drag down from the up air into the up well, smash. Oh, tech tape. Yeah, Let's go for it again. A lot of down Marianne. here. Marion is really controlling this game. Uh, not 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 so much neutral, but when he gets his hits in, it seems like he is getting into his jumping. Oh, oh nice bit of jump that was a beautiful conversion off of that. Yeah, very good jump lead. Now this looks like a repeat of the first game, but the thing, the thing, Jonathan, the thing, the thing with Terry, right? It's like you're never really out. You're never out. Oh, oh wait, it wait, looks like he may be out. It looks like he may be out. No, no, you're out there. I'm that, sorry. That, that, was a, that was a big out. Yeah. That, that was repeat the first game. He just he got he stuck did a good job in the thing. Yeah. 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 He, he yeah. In the beginning of the match, he did he did do a good job. I will say of keeping the center stage and of uh just playing you know at his own pace but i think mm -hmm. marion just definitely overpowered him with that and you know he did a great job i'm proud of him exactly unbiased commentary but i am proud <laughs> of him uh we can get how about gift cut and legumes what about choco joe and carol did they yeah, sure. That sounds good. And so, a bit of round one has been going by. We got Sass E taking it 2 over Crazers. Caro taking it 2 over LeBriant. Uh, Juan Solo DQing. God Triad beating Stell 2-1. And then Tantaka losing to Peon Man 2 0. Oh. That is a surprise. 2 0. That is an yeah. upset. Yeah, that's round 1 2. Mac and Cheese winning 2 0 to Jimbo. Mox and TOK right now are 1 1. And MGKC right now are 1 1. Alright. Interesting. I didn't, didn't hear about Peon Man until, until now. Until now, but okay, he's making a name a name for himself, for himself. Exactly. You know? That's why you. No I mean, that's why you like to see. Though. That's why you like no. to see just just newer players, right? Just coming up. Yeah, that's very interesting. He has, he has no no tournament history. When you look at his Smash GG profile. Just just watch it be like just some sort of Smurf. Someone smurfing on us. <laughs> we don't want to be a PR player. We don't know. It could be. Could he could have played offline? And have uh, been showing up just to. Or it just would still to show if, if, if he's entered any any offline tournaments. It would still show his match history. Yep. True. And I should uh, be hopping up soon. That. MG is is my next opponent, my first opponent. Me. Sure. And then I get to watch Joe. Awesome. Yo. All right, so it looks like our next set might be uh, Joestar versus MG. Yes. As we're still waiting for this one, it's so the one thing about online training is just a bit of waiting you do between the sets. Checking time and stuff. And checking that time. Is where, that is where we come in handy and we fill in the space as commentators. So who do you think is going to win, King Kong or Gertilla? Right now, tell me. Adri, I'm down. Yo. I am always down to show. <laughs> Just to thank the guys that are helping us out. A yeah, special thanks to the York University Student Center for sponsoring uh, our last two months, uh, our last two monthlies, as well as this one. Yes, we and really appreciate them. The next one too. Yeah, they, we they really appreciate them with with advertising and with money. They put a hundred dollars into each tournament that we're running here. Uh, yeah, spe specifically for York U students, and uh, they've helped us out a ton when we were we were on campus before quarantine. 
with allowing us to run our weeklies in their facilities and and just giving us a lot of good benefits. They've been really, really good people to work along with. So we're and happy to have them. Their facilities, got to say, pretty clean. Yeah, they got a nice a nice bar there in the underground. Oh, Ooh, the campus. underground? Ooh, oh, yeah. best part of our gaming York. station. Best part yeah. of our York. It's, it's really chill. Everything's good. Go there, you get the uh, you get your tater tots. Ooh. Oh, we also have their links below. Should be in the stream. So you can go check them out. You can out. find them at yeah, you can find them at yusc.ca. You can follow them on Instagram at Student Center York U and find them on Facebook at York University Student Center as well. And round two, we are going to be getting Joe Store versus MG. Our fabled commentator match that we are all quite excited to watch. All right, so just looking past the last victory. So MG went Joker uh, for his side versus Casey, who won a 2-1. Uh, he won a versus, a versus a local Terry player called Casey. And the thing about Casey is that he is, he's pretty decent, actually. He's, he's pretty good. So, like, it, it was by no means, like, you know, like, you know, like a, like a very easy win. So, mm -hmm. I'm kind of excited for MG to see what he's going to show up. Mm -hmm. We do have some very interesting notes on Joe Store on, uh, on our file. It says he uh, mains Wolf. Yes, that's, that's correct. Indeed. That is that is all all that we have here for this mysterious player. Okay, so it turns out they actually reported their, their match wrong and Casey won instead of MG. Ooh. Oh. So you're gonna be playing Casey? Yes, I'm gonna be playing Casey. And once all again right. we get to see an Artarian stream. Let's go. So yeah, so fill me in fill me in on uh, on Casey's uh, background, Daniel, as you, you know a bit more about the players than I do. Alright, so the thing the thing about Casey is that he loves for when it comes to cherry. He, uh, in my opinion, he plays him a bit differently when it comes to the confirms. Like he loves going for the crack shoot confirms. Like he loves the cross ups, the crack shoot. I think that's what makes him different than other cherries. So and a bit also, more, a bit more aerial, you would say. Yeah, a bit more. Yeah, a bit more aerial. He also likes his snares a lot. Yeah, like he only with snares confirms and stuff. Like to give a difference, like Jonathan, you know, last game he was landing a lot with like power dog. You know, like those, those strong raw hits. Well, mm -hmm. well, as Casey prefers it more, just just mix you up and just crush you up kind of stuff. No. I just go for the good old Sorry to interrupt, but is, this, is my match going to be on stream, Marion? All right. You send the... Uh... No, she... Okay, okay, got it, got it, got it. I wasn't looking at it. Oh, also... Mox beat TLK2 when that I think that might have been close. It's interesting. Just thought I'd mention that. Yeah, that sounds like a close game. Alright, uh just looking more in the bracket, uh more matches. I, I, again to everyone watching, this is just winner round two, right? Like this is still fairly early into your tournament, like there's still like a lot of things that can like can, can change, right? Is there Ooh Okay. That's quite a in my opinion, that's quite the opposite. Oh, I am back. Why is Yeezy in this arena? What the, what happened to the stream? Oh, just when Marion opens up a different window on his computer, oh, okay. then it says the stream's paused. Oh. Now we're just waiting for Casey to get on. Okay. Yes. Uh, Mox so... beat I'm waiting for my next opponent because Mox beat me 2-1. Mm -hmm. Okay. How did that match go? How did the set go? I started really good and I fell off. Because I... Mm. Well, the second game was close and I have dash attacking and Palatina shield and died back throw. Third game, he just... He just can't me out and I just did adapt. That mm. sounds like good old Mox out there. So, so like, <laughs> good yeah. old Mox. I can't blame no Palatina. Yeah. You know, Palatina doesn't have to fight Samus. So you can just sit... So you can kind of just sit back, mash specials, and just yeah. throw her when she gets close. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna hop off comms. Wish me luck, guys. All right, good luck, Joe. Thank you. I'm not saying no good luck All to right. you, sir. You don't need it. You're good enough for that, Joe. Come on, Whoa. come on. You don't need. You don't need a good luck. Commentary. You, have, you have the chat energy. 
All right, so now we have again well, one in chat. <laughs> one in chat if you think Joe Store is gonna win. Yeah, one in chat if you think Joe Store is gonna win. Hit us with the one in chat. And two in chat if you think he's gonna lose. Zero, zero, I think zero, zero and two. Brian. Zero, nobody, nobody, nobody wins. The set never happens. The set never happened. <laughs> can't can't lose if you can't no can't lose if you're not playing. You can't lose if you rig the set. <laughs> can't play. That's it. Fix it? Can't play. In my why you smash? Uh yes. I mean wait wait what? <laughs> I didn't say anything. Hey, it's, not... it's it's not like I have a hundred dollar bets. Joster win the whole thing or anything. I'm I'm again I'm I, I not. All right, going to game uh, one. That, that's illegal side bets. <laughs> <laughs> they are. Please don't do it. <laughs> All right, we're getting into the match. All right, round one. Right, Joe Store versus Casey. Any bet? Any bets? Anyone? 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 No, just kidding. I will put five Ben bucks on. <laughs> five Ben bucks. We have, we, we have not. Bro, we have definitely okay. not. Hey, oh, this one. Oh, oh, okay. So, so hello, guys. Uh, to, for today's presentation, I would like to showcase. Uh, oh, 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 welcome oh. to today's PowerPoint presentation. Oh. Uh, today we'll be talking about not just me, okay? About Brazilian Ken. <laughs> oh dear. I believe it might possibly oh, just be. Just... I believe that was just our signal. It is. Yeah. yeah. It is actually I... super clean on the stream, so we just yeah. look like clowns. Haha. Uh -huh. All right, so Joe taking the first. Uh, Man, I love. I love first, first ball. Yeah, Joe taking oh. this first stock. Spikes him back. Oh, Casey, okay. I see you. I see I don't, you. I don't know how to commentate this, to be, uh, to be quite honest. Well, I, I played Casey You're before. You, he usually has a patient you, you, you need to know how to commentate? Do you go, oh, big, big jab go brr. Big jab go brr. So, okay. So, but, so what I've noticed so far is Joe's doing a really good job of uh, whenever... Casey decides to power wave. Like power dunk over. He, Sorry, go ahead. He decides to short hop laser, and neither, oh, neither, the, the, neither yeah. the laser or. Wait, is this stage ah, on frozen? Yeah. No, just no. Uh, doesn't matter if it has it on or not. There's the platform. I am. Yeah, okay. okay. And right. now right. oh, it's the other stage then. Right. Yes. Yeah, the special stage. Town city power move. Why? I don't know. I wonder how stale his. This is going really Crash fast. Only, oh, he crashed the wrong way. Okay. Not even two minutes in. They're both on the last stock already. That's they're what happens kind of, you. Go, brr. They're kind of just... Pre yeah, they're kind of just pressing. Yeah, they're they're just going at each other. Brr. I can tell you. You, you know, need to know how to come, come and take Terry. You can't play. Yeah. Upper, go brr. I mean, tell hey, this, this, this is what I want to see, right? I want to see two characters go at it. Watch your wolf. Beautiful confirm. He's a death percent that guy here. Yeah, go good. It's anybody's game right now, and that feels very cool. You just said oh, very you cool. do it. Oh, yeah. Oh, he lived it. Good DI from Joe. You just Good said DI from Joe. Confirmed to a, to a forward tilt. Oh, I can't get him. He looked out there for the kill, I think. Into Boston World? Yes. Forward to Boston Wait. He just, Damn. oh, okay, you know what? He just did it, I want yeah. to say, though, that was actually That's a good really special. I want to say, though, okay. that was no Uga Boonga dump. Well, I want to explain what happened there. So whenever you do, whenever you're dealing with, with Terry and you're a death percent, they love going for the jab, jab, power dump. And the way to get yeah. around it is that you need to SDI in, like towards, like you need to hold your stick yes. to, towards the opponent, right, towards but, Terry. But the thing, Terry, Casey, he just waited there. He just waited and went for yeah, there, It's not foolproof, there's counterplay too, and Terry's know this by now. They yes. can do right Terry's jab, jab, right to tackle. Right they can do jab, jab, they can do down to grab. I'm pretty sure that's true for him, down yes. to grab. And so they'll, they can really down tilt for, for Casey. If they down tilt, they can kind of check which what uh, the eye you have. So you can act accordingly. So you really have to just be on your toes. Yeah. That was a very good match. That was very fast too. I, I don't know how I saw a match go that fast in bracket. They just kind of went at it. They just kind of ran at each other, to be honest. Right. And but they, they are honestly, two characters to do that. I wonder what the counter pick's going to be. All right, so after seeing that that chat, oh, we got get a switch. one. You guys think? Oh, Ryu. Get one win switch to Ryu from Streets. That's that's really confusing. He got buffed in the other game, not this one. 
Yeah, this is a game where Ryu's worse. I mean, he's still good, but he's worse. No, 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 no. Yeah, that was a well, that's I'm fair. Could it be so he can mega spam? I have never seen Casey play Ryu actually. It's been his name. Me neither. I've never seen. This is very interesting. I didn't know he had a Ryu. I thought he just played Terry and Gunner. And Sephiroth. Oh, oh, oh but how did Joe him. get hit by that? Oh, Hello? Follow up. Very good. I think Joe's a little off guard by the switch. I think it's a bit of a strategy on Casey's part. Yeah. I can't do this carry next to him because Ryu. That's the girl. Still in Joe's favor right now. Let's try it. No. I, I, I'm, I'm trying to think. The, I think this has to be around focus, though. I think, like, the way this reason why there's a behind he's playing uh, Ryu is because of the length for focus and also because mm -hmm. uh, when it comes to just, like, raw hits, you know, like, Ryu is better. Like, strong hits. And my stream is oh, freezing on. Oh, raw show you there. I can't, raw show sure you? Can't quite tell. And Go was dead. No, Terry's dead. I'm sorry. Uh, Ryu's dead. Excuse me. Get my character picked up here. Oh, a shield break from Casey, and he just raw don't kick right off the side of the street. Oh man, Goodness. I completely missed that shield break. <laughs> and my character call is going down the pits, unfortunately. All right, Joe doing a good job of trying to keep it at his pace. He has stopped yeah. Casey from throwing Shunketsu's by uh, using his uh, his. Uh, his reflector a decent amount. Surprisingly, I almost never see that happen. And it looks like Casey's only going to be using it off of confirm. Oh, good bait trying to catch out the shield. Trying to get the shield breaker over there. Did not quite catch though. I guess Casey might have went Ryu to also just FADC. Actually, I think you guys already said that. It's FADC out of any of the laser pressure that Joe might be putting down. Because Joe, Joe from right now, from what I've seen, has been doing a lot of lasers trying to control neutral. And a lot of Wolf raw forward smash. And confirm it's Tatsu. I didn't I know Tatsu killed there. That's Yeah, crazy. it does. Reuse, reuse that Tatsu with the kill. That is crazy. <laughs> All right, air Tatsu to get back to the stage. Ooh, amazing combo. Gosh. I'm falling behind my stream is liking. Very short combo, but pulled out about 40. Oh, he Casey not down. dashing okay. out of his focus. Rock. Oh, no, 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 I didn't even do that. Oh, it looked like Casey was trying to go for a shorty there. Looks like Casey, looks like Casey's game right now. They, they are, are just pressing pressing buttons Joe, buttons. Joe, is that going to kill? That is going to kill. Alright, Joe. Joe's got a huge, huge back. percent deficit. Bring it back. The thing about Wolf, he has the frame data to take on Ryu at close range, and he misses disjoints, he makes it a little hard for Ryu to get in. Alright, they're playing basically Street Fighter at this point, just throwing projectiles at each other. Right. Barely getting their posts in. Oop, yep, exactly, right there. Joe getting the advantage. Go for a raw down smash, covering roll in. the wrong way. But now Casey's stuck getting off on ledge. Focus, Joe reaches it, doesn't get punished. I think Casey may be getting stuck oh. in focus a little bit. Oh soon. no, oh he missed the Tatsu. That was very interesting to watch. Yeah, yeah I'm curious if he stays on Ryu. That. If he stays on Ryu or does he go does he go back to Terry? Or is he gonna switch to Ken and go through all the characters in one set? I think he will go Ken. If you ask me, I think he's gonna go Ken. I, it would I, be stronger. I, I would be surprised at up, this point. Just straight up raw focus like he's been doing because Joe seems to be getting hit by it and just yep. sure you. Just heavy true yeah. sure, yeah, sure you. Yeah, exactly. And boom. That's all the percent he is yeah. ever going to need. Wolf doesn't like being blown up at close range because he's the, he wants to be the one controlling the space. So if you if you get in his face and make him make him uh, suffer, he doesn't like it. Ugh. Yeah, he does not. I like do at like all. Here. That was an interesting watch, but by the way. And Casey will be, right, be going to back, back, to, back to Terry. I mean, after a so I was right. So he went back to Ken. That's right. Trucker Ken. Trucker Ken. Finally, Ken found a pair of shoes to put on. Buff Pokemon Trainer. Buff Ness, you kick. Ness, screwed. <laughs> Ness got mad when uh, Paula didn't go for him. 
<laughs> He's a big boy now. Oh, the stage is FD Northern Cave. No, no, this is Nark. No, 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 this is the FD version of Nark Cave. Yeah, it's FD Nark. I know it looks the same. It's a little confusing. Yeah. All right, so it is confusing for anyone watching. The difference is that there's no two platforms on the sides, and the ceiling yeah. it's normal FD ceiling. I suppose because Northern Cave has the slowest ceiling in the game. So for oh, oh my here, God. you know the very fast first stock. I even not even 40 seconds. Joe basically carrying the momentum from the last game. That's right. Yeah. He's on fire right now. I think, and the great thing about Joe is that once he hits D, he's not gonna let it go, you know? Yeah, he's, he's a very momentum based player. player. I think Casey did a better. I think Casey did a better. Not to say better. To say at this point in the game that Casey did a better job at controlling space and controlling the pace of the game with Ryu because he had yeah. more access to an aerial Hadouken, he had access to the, the red he fireball. Had better, he had zoning yeah. But right now with uh, with how Joe is basically just able to short hop perfectly over his, uh, his power yeah, wave. Power wave. Yeah, his and throw it. For his fire. Also, one thing to notice is that for the first game, they won PC1 uh, with Terry. Oh, good call out. Just, just to roll power guys here. Uh, the one he won, he won it because he got such a like, like raw uh, hit, like spike, like a very early one. But although he has go, and that's already 50%, hold up. And that, that's the last man Terry has to go on the next one. Oh, he makes it back. Did you make the hands or not? He should, he should have not made it back. Joe Sturt. Oh, okay, there we go. Not looking good for Casey right now. Very high depth, very high depth. Missing, the thing, the thing with Casey rather is that he actually could have made it back, but he missed both times the proper input for uh, up beat. And if you miss oh, it, the missed the one, right? Yeah, the missing one. If you win, miss it, you're get... very vulnerable. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah I know Joe... that's a riddle. Does. So Joe being at a high percent at his second stock and Casey being on his last, honestly, Casey can possibly take this back with that power dunk. Yeah. If he gets this edge guard and then gets the high percent with go. Uh, oh, he he most thing. likely be able to do that. Casey right now is looking a little desperate for the kill for random smashes. Joe is too common a player to get hit by those, I think. Oh, missing the parry right there. It's not looking good for Casey right now. Really good at uh, power geyser. He wants a power geyser kill again like last time. Keep this all. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, there we go. Third time in a row, he makes us the the proper input for the OB, and he just gets punished by it. But you know what? Great stuff by both. You know, great stuff by watch. Joe Star. Good set, good set to both players. I'm not sure if Casey screwed the momentum by just going to Ryu game two and going back to Terry. But I thought maybe he should have stuck with Ryu. Because as um, Tyler said, he was very close. Yeah, he, he, he was just able to, you know, just, just good old Ryu gameplay, just you know, just focus attack, just just Hadouken more often, you know, it gives you more control. But the thing with Terry is that you cannot go, to, like, you need to get your input. That's the thing when it comes to recovering, you need to get a proper input. Because Terry's recovery, compared to also the other two shadows being real and Ken, is so much, it's so much worse in my opinion. And if you screw up the input, it's gonna be even more. Oof, that was scary. You oh, hello, did a fantastic <laughs> job, Joe. Joe, I know. what was going through your mind no, sir, while please you were playing that match? Please oh. actually yeah. hire me. Yeah, that what went through... Clean. Really quick, what went what went through your mind when you saw that he switched over to Reed? I was like, that's kind of unnecessary, but I also don't like the matchup. And really? what was yeah. going, then what was going through your mind after you completely demolished the first stock when he switched back to Terry? I thought that was it. Like... <laughs> <laughs> I had the read. It's it. I had the read. I had the lead, and so like I'm in a really good position right now. That's a good right? point. I had the read. I had the lead. He's, he's in the he's in the arena. You gotta like I don't have to approach, and I feel confident that I know what he's gonna do next. So, and I feel like I showed that. Both Terry? Are you familiar with both Terry and Ryu matchups? Ryu, I play my brother a lot, but he doesn't do a lot of the same combos. It was kind of like different. Like I know neutral is just stay away because you got scary buttons, and Terry's kind of the same thing. It's like stay away because you got scary buttons. Uh, and yeah, I don't think you, I did that enough in game yeah. one. Yeah, the fact game that you got clipped with a you got clipped with a couple of things. Uh, you did a really good job in neutral against the fireballs, and uh, yeah. honestly, him carrying that over, I honestly think that he could have he could have possibly done a bit more with the Ryu. 
but I feel yeah. like he went back to Terry for the comfort pick because he lost with both. But honestly, he could have he could have played a bit more neutral with Ryu. Uh, seems like I think he should have been closing like you, in. It seems like you had Terry figured out basically. Is what yeah. I'm trying to say. Yeah. Oh I know wait, he likes to go for the downers at ledge. Something so I want to mention. Ledge pretty safely. Something I want to mention though, at losers round two because you sent Casey to losers, mm -hmm. uh, he's now has to play against Lars, which is another Terry player. Yeah, this so is all Terry. And I'm I know like Terry four right Terrys on Terry playing. alone. Terrys are everywhere, man. I'm playing yeah, Terry the, the Terry here. Because right here we got Lars, we have Ugar, we have Casey, and of course we have Riddles on 47 on PGR. We are just Terrys everywhere, man. Don't forget about Jonathan. Yeah, it, actually, I'm very impressed with Jonathan. Like he, he. Obviously, maybe not enter like little turnips beforehand, but you know, he, like he, you know, he was just being round one. He got essentially thrown against the wolf that was Marion, but he still, you know, had a pretty good, like solid footing. Oh, Jonathan's there. You're right. Sorry. Right. I'm gonna go right. play my match versus Venifang. All right. Good luck, Joe. Thank you. All right. Best of luck, Joe. Hope to see you later in the bracket. I am still waiting for another opponent. Opponent to see. Yep. Oh, DK Bills on the so something to know about Sassy. Sassy did go Pikachu for their first set. Yep, against Crazy and Falco, 2 0 him. And we are going to see a Pokemon battle with a Pikachu and Greninja. Oh, it's Pika Libre. I love this game. Pika Libre. You know, know Pikachu I, Libre I, is a girl. You can tell by the heart shaped tail. Yep. Now, I'm no Pokemon fan. What's what type of edge here? Is there a type of edge here? It's the, quite uh, literally it's electric and water, which is yeah, the, the okay. most known type advantage. That's All true. right, getting into it, Marion and Sassy trying to get their combo starters on each other already. Both kind of just pressing buttons all over the stage. Right. Yeah. One thing I want to notice though is that you just watch watch Sassy the spam backers. Is that Sassy? Uh, oh wait, let's go bit. Oh no. Pikachu's recovery is way too good to, to be yeah. gimped there, in my opinion. I be, at least I believe. Yeah. But you never know, because so many Pikachu players are so comfortable, like, like they get spoiled by having such a good recovery, that sometimes oh, sure. they, they get too predictable, you know? That's fair, understandable. Broad down, down smash, smash take... just as a whiff punish on that down tilt. That's what I'm gonna do. It. Oh. Sassy seems oh, to no, be going what? for a lot of confirms just, that just aren't there, and it looks like they're hoping for it to just kind of hit. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it must be a good turn he's used to getting. Wait, Nair into Jab? Okay, there we go. Yeah, he, he messed up, he messed up the dragon on Nair into up smash. Good stuff. Sitting on the platform, just sitting there menacingly, waiting for it. Menacingly. Just saying, Don't. just saying, approach, do it. I'm just going to keep Thunder Jolting. What are you going to oh do? Oh my god. Was that a, was that a JoJo reference? You know what? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Not everything's a no kill reference. Oh, back here, back here. Back here. Oh, getting him off double, stage. See how he's going there. Gimp. Does not gimp him. Decides to just sit on the stage and press the B button. That sounds like a Pikachu. Pikachu. That does. All right. The platform being a little bit too Wait, tall. Is Mary did not trip. Is that the also bold? Can bust it. This Pikachu do be looking busted. Like... He's Sam sucking. He is he is dressed as a Libre and you know where you know where they reside in the boxing ring. <laughs> Good grab by Marion. <laughs> you know what? Marion's still missing his first. Production telling us that he does indeed hate it here. <laughs> <laughs> oh good. Any, 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 any production out of here. Any that production. That's all I have to say. He's gonna go around. Oh, Mary missing the ledge drop. Unfortunately, because that was stuck right there. And now it's gonna be Nerlips, but Sassy also missing the Nerlips. Sassy just pressing buttons. She's just like they. That is Pikachu for you. They're just pressing buttons. That's not open until actually. That's not looking very good for Mary right now. Oh, that was very unnecessary. Marion definitely can do this. Production saying oh, Marion can do this for now. Production bias. Okay. Nice. Nice conversion. Nice Decent yeah, amount of percent. Oh, nice. Great trade with that forward air. The jab trying to get a confirm. Nice. 
nothing really there. Oh, Brago just because passed. Not quite gonna do it just yet. Yeah. Let's see how Marion can. Beautiful Great. counter. Very Kill. good. Very my percent. Yeah. Marion at the magic percent. Power is in his hand. Not part. Commentator. Oh, oh, just oh, kidding. We did oh, that's him. just random. That's so, you know what? I respect it, but I also hate it. Sassy has, I been, has been just pressing buttons. Like I said, yeah. I'm a broken record. Pressing buttons, random buttons. Wait, I don't oh, yeah. go, go. You were saying the right thing here, Anchor. I think. Pressing buttons. Roll the dice. Like what? It's it's like it's like what they say. You mash your face on the controller hard enough, and you can end up with you, you can combo into knee every single time. All right, but with Pikachu, <laughs> you just keep pressing, you just keep pressing your face against the controller, and you'll just win. Uh, something I want to mention, goes. like that's part of like last game, but sadly Sassy was going too hard, so they were not allowing me. Was the fact that Pikachu, a great thing about backer, the reason why it's so spammable, whenever you use backers Pikachu, you pancake afterwards. That's right. So you low propel a lot of stuff. Oh, and Greninja, true. Greninja, Greninja small to with. Poor, yeah, and Greninja has a poor out of shield game, in my opinion. Like, it's definitely one of his weakest parts. So, Might be the worst part. Might be the worst in the game, just because he just, you just, yeah. you can't do much on it. You can't do much against people's shield. You're first to get out, out of it, right, and try to attack. Yes. So, going back honestly, into it, no sassy, I'm just back carrying him to death. Yeah, we got Pokemon music for a real Pokemon battle. And once again, Sassy is going to immediately start throwing out some Eagle to control state. Marion's yeah, yeah, not going to fall for it. Marion doesn't care about anything. Marion's doing an amazing. Marion's setting the pace early match. Already he's getting dragged down. Drag down. Oh, he misses oh, the Gimper. Okay. And now he's going to drag down and him. And Nair loops. Oh, never mind. He, he's going to actually empty out of that. Out of the Nair loop. SDI up and away. Uh, you can. But, yes, uh, I've done it with, my, with Samus at least. Amazing down air conversion oh, in the forward air. Oh, so spicy. I love it. Marion, I need to see more of it. Come on. As oh, the zoomers. Yes, give it to me. Come on. Oh. As the zoomers say, Marion's crack. Crack. Marion's crack. He is getting oh, disrespected at the corner. Nine? We're gonna just hold out and get away from that. Yeah. Very good. Yeah, one, one thing is that it's it's weird to say because I think Ninja is such a flow charty character, in my opinion, which is one oh, it's like an weakness of the character. But the somehow I feel, I feel like Sash is being even more flow charty. Oh, nice, cute let charm. That's not gonna do it though, because it's FD. It <laughs> just that is going to kill. No, no, that's not gonna kill. No, that's gonna do it though. All right, both competitors are just trying to look for the next hit. They're just playing a bit of neutral. A bit of fruits is going on right here, and it looks like. Like, the book just kind of just overcommit like bot, right? Like, what they're going for. Even if they so miss. Far, Marian, they're looking much better this game than last one. Like, do you see that? Like, 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 Pikachu can just angel into the your shield and they just out. That's he's gonna. Right. Not kid. Oh, Mason by. Yeah. Too long range recovery, that one's gonna get back. Oh, so good jerk. Is that off he just, I, I think he just jumped chill, down. right? Of course. Yep. That was a re-grab. Marion was just waiting there the whole time. Like, he did not care about any Thunder stuff. He did not care about Thunder. Or, like, you know, anything Pikachu was going to do. Because he knew that the moment he re-grab ledge, he was dead. Good stuff. It looks like Seth is going to be pretty desperate out here. Looking for the yeah, Looking for those, like, raw kit kills. Right now. Fair does not get the fair. Oh, good stuff, Assassin. Though, just like you know, just playing a be more of a get up game instead of a just. Oh, Baron's in a good, very good spot right now. I think he's, he's thinking I was good. I'm just about. I think I just cursed him. But he still he has zero second too. Oh, very good. So as long as Marion can, as long as Marion carries center stage doesn't commit to anything too hard, I believe that he will have this in the bag. It's just, yeah. he cannot do anything over middle, and he cannot- Oh, back here? Wait, wait, hold up, back here, oh. Never mind, never mind, There we go. Before Very nice. Off the left side of the stage, Marion, Sassy, 1-1, one, one, doing an amazing job keeping his cool at the end there.
almost as though he can hear us. But he can't. Because that would yeah. be cheating. That will be cheating, right? Yeah. No mid-set coaching at all. But now we are going to be getting into game three. I wonder what the counterpick stages are going to be. I don't know what's uh, maybe I go, it might be Kalos because I think I hear Pikachu is very good on Kalos. I don't know about us good as ages for Ninja. There's uh, no bands, right? Or uh, there's no, one band, band for the for the. No, they got, they, they, the got, they got yeah, one band. Okay, two bands. All right, two bands. So one thing about Kalos is that Kalos has balls. Called it. And then, uh, there it is. There's Kalos right there. Right. Okay, so I'm gonna take my five dollars. Yep. All right. Well, finish Pokemon battle on a Pokemon safe because why not? Yeah. The one thing though about Cal is that it's it's that uh, it has walls, and the Tijols they can travel around the wall, so it makes okay. us so Pikachu comes back cool, we see on me. every single time. All right, I'm starting off the back here. Yeah. Wait, wait, oh wait, so something interesting about uh, Saxy, I think he knows he's convert like conversions, but he doesn't know like the like how to do like the train control playing Pikachu like. No, he's he he not quite done yet. Yeah, very, he have very answer with a higher percent. Can't he could have gone for more right stuff right there. He could have 100% gone for more stuff, but he just chose yeah. to go Marion chucking him off the page with a forward smash. Gets a fair ledge, just like a Samus made. That's me. Alright, grabbing. Keeping it on platform, allowing the pressure get to let him, letting him come to get back to but yeah, those Tijols are just really good in Palos. Like, you see, there's a lot of pressure. You can just back, back away, Tijol, Tijol, Tijol. Oh, like nice. is, is this, this is a very magic number again. This is a very grounded game, though. Marion is not is spending a lot of time on the ground. And Sasti is the one going in the air more often, and Marion generally goes in the air when he has a follow-up. Marion definitely is playing a little bit slower, which is to his mm -hmm. benefit, because Sassy, like I said earlier, just Whoa. took out a match oh, and and as long there. as... As long as Marion keeps his pace, he's forcing Sasuke to come to him, right? Yeah. But I honestly think I'm not playing him though, because like sometimes this guy just goes for like the like such good plays. Sometimes like like well not sometimes like a lot of times he would just right randomly just teach you like such a really good play. Like that edge card that just happened. Yeah. The, well, yeah. That that's just the the quirk of having a a really good recovery. You can go as far off stage for any kill that you want, right? Yeah. So Marion actually putting in Try all this work for the single combo. Very good. Jeez. Oh, oh wait, hold up. Everybody the skull bash. There. But yeah, the skull bash is stopping us. Unfortunately, he actually had the reload. Very, very brave. I can't say brave, but he should recover anyway. <laughs> Marion. Yeah, he's Marian. trying to keep out these DJs. Not really working. I don't see Marion can get by them often. He gets the grab. This is a follow up. Marion definitely cracked. Getting caught Ooh, by the thunder. Second. Yeah. But right now it's all Sassy though. Right now Sassy oh, has that. pressure. Shield grab. Sassy really pressing, pressing more buttons here. These forward tilts for Marion are really scary. Oh. I can't, I can't tell if he can cancel the animation or not. But it does look he like... He missed the ledge from right there, unfortunately. That should do it. Well, Good got conversion. Alright, Marion can I definitely... I think he has this. Definitely. I don't want to curse, don't want to curse him again. Oh. See, I just cursed him. So Marion's just got to... Marion definitely just has to keep playing at his pace like he has okay. throughout the match. Keep his cool. I mean, we know he's good at doing that. Went for a ledge trump. Oh my god. Grab. Could be an air loop. Uh, air loop. Yep. Air loop. Here we go. Here we go. Another Here we one. go. Oh, whoa, nice. whoa. Oh. Only, honestly, that's pretty cheap. You should be grateful to come out because like that much percentage into you. Yeah. Cheek Cheek means hate to you. Oh, right. yeah, Marion Marion with his patented out there drag down. Oh, beautiful. Oh, he should have done the grab there. I think he's going for mix up. Oh, very good. Yep. We get the off stage shortcut. Nope. Oh, nice. Good. Oh, he did. He went for a jump reset. Amazing. Very nice. Amazing countering the Eagle. Beautiful. Yeah, he counted the people and sent him straight upward. That's it. Yeah, he's he gone. was like, he was like, get out of here. That was on Cal Cal too. That was on infamously high ceiling, and he killed him like at a very low percent. Great stuff, uh, to Marion. Marion Mary coming it, it, out it, it of it. but it's it was a good call because Marion was always <laughs> holding shield every time a kill came by. So this time he was like, you know what? I'm gonna take the hit and gonna kill you with it. 
they were they were probably holding up or something. I think so. Yeah. Well, if, for sure. Me, who could ninja or uh, uh, Pikachu? Pikachu. The Pikachu, Pikachu. Yeah. probably. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe just holding up. I mean, I still I still oh. think Sassy oh. should like a lot of. Oh, the, oh. Like, yes, who's fighting Sassy now? I am. Woo! I think Sassy still did like a lot of good stuff. I think just Sassy just needs to get a bit more of the conversions down because the thing with Pikachu is that if you get the the really hard to do combos down, you don't have to rely so much on like randomly hitting like a thunder or like a like a forward smash, you know? Mm -hmm. Oh, Joe, too, was Venom Fang. Good stuff. That yeah, Terry, he's gonna slaughter Terry, Terry's tonight. But now he has to play against Peon Man, too, which is high. Yeah. yeah, man, he plays. Much, much this he plays. Though. He sent Gamer to losers playing Roy and Snake. And he also, he also beat Tantaco 2 0 with Roy. And yeah. beat Mac and Cheese 2 0 with Wolf and Ike. So it seems like he knows, his, knows him quite a few characters. I do think this guy just be smurfing on us, honestly. Crazer is out. LeBriant is out. Darn. Oh. And still. So, a bit of an update are on the winner side of things. We have top eight started soon. And for the loser side of things, we are Four. still all the way losing to round three. Three more rounds to get to top eight in the loser sides. So there's still a bit, to, a bit of something to catch up on the loser side of things. I'll be back and I get to, to play my set. I yeah, you should. Sure. Yep. yep. So, Daniel, what does the bracket look like? Give me your give me your predictions. So far, right, so... I keep hearing about. I keep hearing about this uh this one guy who's tearing through that, that nobody knows. What, what's yeah, his Peon name? Man, like if you go to Smash G, like there's not much on him. And he like at least the person we we're talking about earlier, but he 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 beat our essentially like our one of like a four seated and like seed and he also beat like a really good player Tentacle earlier as well. So wait, Peon Man to yeah, he he two oh Tentacle. He 2-1 two, two over Mac and Cheese, which is also really good because Mac and Cheese is quite the uh, quite quite a, quite a strong player, honestly. If you ask me, like Wi-Fi, I, like I, I know he plays Mac, and it's a bit of a meme, <laughs> you know. But mm -hmm. like, I, I I have I have fought against him Elite before. I don't know if he remembers me because I was just playing secondary, but I fought against him beforehand in Elite, and he's like pretty good. Also, see, I actually see him like in, a, in like in randoms, like just weapon turns actually as well. Just he just pops up, like he's pretty decent. So that's a good another good win. And then he beats he beat gamer, mm -hmm. which is uh, again two one. Although to be fair, gamer plays DK, and that card is bound to get a gimp. All right. So from our sources, that explains a lot. We're hearing yeah, that Keon Man is great. I don't know if the stream actually heard that yet, but Peon, Peon Man, is it Peon Man or is it Peon, Peon Man? Man? No, Peon, right. Peon Man. Man. It would be funnier <laughs> if his name was Peon Man, but Peon, I, I Man, agree as well. Peon Man is indeed great. That explains so much, yeah. Uh, and if you can give some some background on who Grape is. Nutty, Nutty, Nutty Ontario Snake Player. Just Nutty. The definition of Nutty that's great. I think that. I think that says it. Yeah. Uh, honestly. Yep. So and, and also he, I believe, if I remember correctly, uh, in offline environment, he made it to Ontario PR. Yeah, just he's a really good player, like for Ontario. See, I knew I was someone smurfing on us. I knew it. Someone, someone, someone get this Damn. like elo crop. I can't, someone... I can't believe. I can't believe. So, I can't believe they they Ryu played us. <laughs> they Ryu played. Have, you, have yeah. you heard about that? Uh, will you will, will you mind explaining to everyone? So the watching? new the new update in Street Fighter Five, along with Dan Hibiki, coming out as a playable oh. character and Eleven. Uh, a since Ryu got buffed, Ryu got hella buffed. All right, with V Shift with uh, his 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 standing medium punch 
is now, I believe, plus two on block. That's his main poke. It's great. And, uh, honestly, Ryu just got hella buffed. Somebody entered, uh, I believe it's a Wednesday night fights or a weekly. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No. With the name literally just as Ryu player. And then when he, he won the tournament, swept everybody. And then when they were trying to give him his prize, he said, give my winnings to whatever homeless guy needs it. And then did. And then I think everybody thinks it's Alex Vaya, but, uh, that would make oh, sense. Uncle Vaya. Yeah. Yeah, we because actually just got from Flair. The, the fact that, the fact that they buffed Ryu, and then nerf Guile. Yo, Capcom wants Daigo. Capcom wants Daigo they, back. Yeah. They want yeah, going back to the set because he has a race started. Uh, Spe speaking of Ume Shoryu, uh, Game & Watch can basically do that. <laughs> <laughs> if you see, if you... The up, the up and the B button. Well, if you're playing on a box. Uh, if you're, you're up on the analog stick in the... Your B button, that's your best friend. That is your best friend. Oh, he's gonna do it. Oh, there he is. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, there's you, the up you, thing. Yeah. You, you know what's so funny about Game & Watch? Is that if you... You can do a very cool combo, which is neutral get up into up B. Neutral get up as in, as in like, get up attack? No, no, no. No, j j just get up normally. Like, with an attack. Just get up. And That's up air. Oh, because it's invincible. Right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, Marion getting the stock with a forward smash. Maryland kind of kind of nasty. All right. So, I really like to see the 14% combos from Palu. Wow, it's so good. Dash so attack, good. helmet kills. Always wear your helmet. All right. So, so we, I agree. We, they got into this man. They got into this match pretty fast. I was I was rambling on about Alex Valle and uh, Ryu getting buffed, and then him also being in Fortnite. I was not, but you know what? Let's pretend we were. Uh, yeah, let's pretend we were. Uh, I believe that's how you pronounce his name. How? Uh, what's the backstory on this guy? Uh, uh he has been quite honestly quite the Game and Watch just like player. Like one one of the best things I, I can say about him is that uh, he he sticks with Game and Watch. That's it. And you know some people say, oh, you know filthy filthy one trick. Oh, you whatever. But the thing's like you get better by sticking with one character. And he just been sticking with, like. Like love to keep watching it and like it really respect it, you know. That's very that's fair, yeah. Like they just come in to give me a watch and like he has gone much better like doing like like he I my opinion I he's the, the strongest when he does like the first like pressure with like the bomb, the fair. Like mm -hmm. he's really good at doing that and backers. The one thing is that you cannot do that on Palu when you're a death percent because you get back throw just like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Marion's kinda Marion's kinda just schmoving on him. I, that's a I can comfortably say that. Oh, just a dang up grab against the bomb. Goodness. Marion has no feet. The cojones this man. Jeez. Oh, nice. Nice up there. The counter. Oh, he knew he was going to upset. Oh, wait, wait, hold up. Yes, bucket. Yes, bucket. Yes, bucket. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, 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 oh. That, that didn't. That felt a little. Just a little bit. I know it wasn't. Actually, no. Knowing Marion, it might have been. <laughs> yeah, knowing Marion, yes. But I don't think it was because it was the right decision. Like, 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 he, like he, you saw him drifting to the left, so you just dash back and forward. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like considering, that considering that Marion went Palu instead of playing his main, really sick main. Uh, I th I can I can hazard a guess that he just kind of. Oh, never mind. He's a dual main. All right. It's no a, longer just solo Greninja. The thing with Paolo is that Paolo is a character you go when you're not that like, comfortable in a matchup. Because Paolo just wants uh -huh. it for you. Paolo, you go, the wait, I you know go. Is matchup. Let me go Paolo. Paolo, yeah, Paolo's the character you go when you're playing low tier and you are go and you go, okay, I just... Pa Paolo is the is the Dante it of the team. It's a, a low tier. Yeah, it's, 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 it's like their team, team but it's the Dante of like their team. Here, if, I'm gonna watch, I'm gonna watch is like the opposite low tier, and that, that does... Paolo does not care. Paolo will not care. Alright, we're bringing it back. That's one thing with Gita though, is that Gita will, will play for sure. They give me a watch though. Um, and also one quick thing to note, as well as that the winner, because this is the quarter finals, the winner of this will go to top 8 for a tournament. I can, see Marion, I can definitely see Marion taking it. Pretty far, definitely high up in the rank. Also, updates 
on Peon Man, aka Grape, versus Joestar. Joestar taking the first game of one Amazing. Joe definitely one again. Carrying, yeah, Joe definitely carrying the momentum from uh, from his previous match. Yep. Oh, look at that recovery by Marion. Oh, no fear. Runs up against the up smash. Just, just dash it. It doesn't think with Paolo. I don't know. I don't know if you know this, but oh, Nightbacker. But that's not gonna take it. The thing with Paolo is that her dash attack is invincible. I did not know that. Yep. And that is frightening to know. Yeah, so the, the, she uses her shield, as you can see that. That beats out every single move in the game. That will just beat out. Same goes for backer. That's He's why you fishing for a grab. Oh, no, he was fishing for a forward smash there. I thought he was just going to oh, nice. nest. I honestly thought he was just going to nest cheese him and just wait for a grab and then just... Yeah, never mind. He went for a yep. forward smash and just just kind of die, right? But I think this is, yeah, but I believe this is where he gives me, like, bring it back. Oh, nice bucket again. Okay. Oh, yeah, I hit by the bucket. It did all, it did a lot. Of, what percent did that oh. do? 30-something? Like yeah, 30-something. I mean, any damage matters, because, like, the big, yeah, th like, that's gonna take the suck, but now, it's not like, you know, now Paulo's at 42, right? Like, it's still pretty good. But remember, Game & Watch is pretty light. Yep. Can possibly just gets hit by the wind box there. Nothing else. But no, Gideon he doing did. a Gideon doing a pretty good job of keeping center stage. Marion trying to do some cool drag down stuff. Oh, but, uh, yeah. I was, I was gonna say even, even just just like you know making sure like Marion does not come like. Like takes it like he's trying to control like, central stage as much as he can. Mm -hmm. Yeah. it. Although the one thing is that I think now like right now he's becoming a big predictable. Like see like Marion's actually getting around him. Back to say. Oh, the just stage, random how is that, how that work? How is that? Why does that stand up? Why does that stand up, Sakurai? Why does that stand up? I can I can understand that thing burn you. I can understand that thing send you to sideways because that thing you should send to sideways when you don't get like. Like the proper hit, but it doesn't up. Oh, what just happened there? Some wow. Oh, Marion okay, rolls into hit. the up man. Gideon? This could be it. Backer? Another backer? Oh, Ooh, that's it. That's the that's the that's the game. Mr. Beep, beep. The beep beep press up smash. Beep beep up beep. Alright, well, now, I believe Will Marin will switch back to main deck, right? Like, one will assume he's gonna switch back, right? Hmm. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> the stream is definitely still up. All right, so as we get into it, 1-1 one, one, Gideon and Marion. Uh, yeah, it's... I'm just trying to think, like, what's gonna be, like... Because the thing with Gideon is, like... The thing with Greninja is, that, again, Greninja is so good at pressure on you. Like, are you gonna play the same way, right? Oh, and now that we're going to FD, right? So you don't have the platform to create, like, you cannot just, like, backer to backer, like, you cannot do that anymore, right? To control center stage for free. Like, what are you gonna do now? Just up B, just trying to get away from pressure. Twist up a Gideon. Oh, there it is. Beep, beep. I believe uh, if Gideon wants to win this, uh, he just needs to keep doing what he was doing last game. But do it, just be better. Because I don't think it's going to be I, good enough, though. I think Marion may possibly have the, oh, that's gonna the sauce it. on it. Oh, wait, hold up. Download, the download, as they might say. I, I feel like, that. A, yeah, Gideon Gideon may have to just bring out the schmix, you know? Yeah, he has to he's bring got, out the schmix. He's got the peanut butter, he's got the jam, but he's got he's to gotta put it together. you gotta, you got to alternate, you know? I agree. Otherwise, otherwise it's just not going to work. 
you can't have the same thing every day. Also, I'm sorry, TDM, but that, that's an ugly ass color for, for Game & Watch. That's so... I, I'm sorry, but that's just... I hate, I hate that color. For Game & Watch? The, like, the weird green. moldy green color? Yeah. Neil Drun... Yeah, yeah. That sent Greninja really high up. Oh, weird DI. Straight down into the stage. Just narrowing the bomb so he can get rid of the hitbox. Yep. And Mary getting oh. sent off stage, but I think one up smash maybe may possibly get him. Like who? Game and watch this. For sure. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Mary just has to get that one confirmed. That's it. There yeah. we go. That's oh, confirmed. Mary just controlling pace, doing an, an amazing job at actually playing neutral. What do you mean actually? Are you saying he was not playing neutral before? I'm saying nobody plays neutral in this game, Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot lie to you, my friend. I mean, you, I saw, you saw how Sassy was playing. No, yep. no, no fault on Sassy. They played kind of sick. But <laughs> if you want to talk about neutral, then uh, these two players have been doing a pretty good job of controlling neutral. Even if it may be a little bit flow charty on, uh, on one end. Marion does seem to have the download on this. See, again, there with uh, Gideon doing the up smash at the roller. Oh, do it. Oh, 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 oh it's light. Oh, 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 oh. I can't even get. So you knew what I was saying. Well, that, and that's it. That's a 2 1 victory for Marion. Mm hmm. Yeah. Even it was... though it says on the top 0 0, guys. It's it's two one for Marion. Marion takes it two one, moving to top eight. Winner side, hello, let's go, Marion. Marion definitely on the graphic. Gideon exiting frame one, just like Game and Watch is up. I'm kidding. I yeah. actually don't know the frame. I actually don't know the frame data for it. Yeah, and then he will be playing against Choker Joe. Oh wait, on like Game and Watch FP? Yeah, Game and Watch FP. I want to say it's it's I want to say it's uh it's frame one or frame two. I want to say that. In the meantime, uh Miss Marion and uh, no. Now looking how the bracket is well, for winner semifinals we have Marion Joker Joe, which is about to start soon. On the other side of the winner semifinal we have Peon Man 2, aka Grape, playing against Joester. It's one one now. Um, actually, never mind. I just finished. It's a victory, a nice, a two-one victory for Joester. Joester moving to the uh, winners' finals. Although, mm -hmm. I think you know, does a pure man did just go Roy? Well, I mean, I have not heard about Grape since like offline, but they were like on Terra PR on 2019. So, like, just before you know, obviously just before pandemic, and their main word was Snake. So I don't know if like Roy is like a more like. Their wife would pick as like now their main, their co main. I don't know much, but point being, so that was just their point. Oh, okay. I just got told by production that the matches are so good that we're actually the best of five. Uh, uh, starting now. So Joe Stir is still is not yet on winner's finals. He has to win one more. On looser side of things, uh, Lars and Mox are now playing. And Mox being 1-0 up. And then Legumes uh, taking out Tentacle out of the, the tournament. Legumes being a player. Legumes. Good stuff, honestly. Nice, nice 2 1 win. And now Venom Fam and, and Legumes are now are not gonna be playing in in looser sites. Mm -hmm. Hey, fun game I watch. Alright. Let me tell you how. Okay, how fast is his up B? Up B three from three. On shield, also on three. <laughs> Third frame. All right, so that's uh, that's Ganon. That's that's melee Ganon's jab. Nice. Nice. It is pretty good. I just good. love referring to everything that I hear as three frames as Ganon melee jab. Yeah, I do that. Back. I do that with every. I do that. Shit, I do that with shit. Shit in other fighting games too. <laughs> it's like pretty bad. Like how? I not do it. Like how? Like how? 
Just give me, you gotta give me an example. I'll, I'll hear like, yo, forward three is like, or a forward one, or forward two is a, is a frame three. It comes out frame three, it's his best poke. And I go, yeah, like Ganon in Melee. And they're dead. <laughs> like Ganon in Melee? Like that one character Melee? Yeah. All right, and now we're, yeah. Ooh, we're gonna have some cool matches coming up right now. <laughs> So we're actually gonna have like Goobs versus Venom Fam on the stream. Definitely excited to see some more Terry action. Can you can you ever have enough Terry? Personally, can you I ever don't. Have there's, enough Terry? There, there's no such thing. Terry. If you watch a tournament, there's never that Terry. No such thing as too much Terry. That is also the reason why I do not want to play Terry anymore. <laughs> Just too much Terry everywhere. Too much Terry. I feel like Terry became too mainstream. And God, I sound cringy saying okay. that. Okay, oh, okay, I hear you. I, I see you. Purple dinosaur. I'm only ninety kids. Only ninety kids will, will, will remember Barney. You know, is, is this how we're going? Barney versus Ken with a hat. <laughs> Yoshi is indeed one of my favorite Nintendo characters. And to answer any questions before they are asked, no, I do not eat blue. Oh, I was about to... And I do not evade taxes. Cap, bro, cap. Do you see, do you, do you see, do you see Joshi's shoes? Do you think that man gets those Gucci Gucci's shoes? Gucci dripping! Ooh. Man, man, but drip! <laughs> Alright, production is told us with their action temps. I, I do have, I do have that image saved of Big Yoshi, but it's, he's like... He's photoshopped, oh, okay. he's photoshopped Wait, to a different color and has Tim's on. Yeah, I want to say, this guy, Le Gloomis, he might be a taxi failure, but he'd be schmoovin'. No wonder he's a taxi failure. Yeah. He ain't got the schmoofs. Le you know? He definitely didn't go for Are You Okay there. It's so weird seeing Yoshi jump out of shield in this game. I don't like it. It's it's such I a mean, like, nerd. I didn't like it because he has armor on his jump. Who allowed that? Who allowed that? Nintendo? Oh, okay. Ooh, Just there's throw. the Buster Wolf. Okay. That, that's... Kids, watch who, who are watching this uh, this stream. That's why you don't evade taxes, right? Or else there's gonna come and you're gonna Buster Wolf with you. <laughs> I <Iron. laughs> It's gonna. <laughs> It's, it's gonna go down till down oh till my God. Yeah. Now. they were both <laughs> sitting in their shield. Then I'm paying at a very, very high percent. Oh no, he's like chilling. He's chilling. If, you, if you're Terry, you're chilling. You're mad chilling. He just really likes nearing out of shield. I mean, that's what you do with Joshi. Oh my like, goodness. Okay, my man. Okay, it's like a massacre. <laughs> Just reset, just reset, go re, go next, just go next. Actually, wait, never mind. If he can take the yeah. It's scary we're talking about. Like, it's so easy to, like, this character. Remember in Smash 4 when Yoshi's, like, every hit of Yoshi's down air did 40%? Yeah. 40%? Good old days. Jesus. The good old days. I indeed did love Yoshi in Smash 4. Okay, but this, like, like, that's the thing about Lair the Goon. He gets this like really good conversions, but then it's like just no, he's not that. Oh, he is now. Wow. All right. That was some mis input because he could have made it back. He, he did uh he did fair instead of just uh upy. But the thing's like oh. I'm sorry. I'm just out of words with this like. I this no. Me too. Me too. Me too. Yeah. I'm out of words. Because Legume. Oh uh, my he's, god, he's wait. bringing it back. Alright. Oh, he went oh, for the narrow out stage. Cooking his shield, No, no oh missing. Oh my god. Hard. Too much percentage? Why didn't he forward, forward smash? Alright, what's I going on here? Up. We have anything and then. Just let's do it. Okay. Oh. That. Fin fin oh. And Legume is dead. That was very upsetting to watch, and I don't know if anybody else would agree with me for that one. I just came I, back. Can someone give me a give me a heart. recap? Uh, so what happened was that Legumes was evading taxes like usual, and then the IRS tried to stop. Oh. But then, and then just as he was about to escape uh, and leave the country, uh, Venom Time said, "No, get back here." I, I guess Terry Boger, my favorite agent of the uh, IRS. 
<laughs> yes. Where, wherever you go, they will follow. Ugh, I, I am out of the bracket. I lost 2-0 to Sassy. Ready? Anyways, That's going back thing. into this. And yes, he is playing Pikachu, he presses buttons. But you know what? He's a good one. Respect to him. He's we'll a be good yeah, He presses buttons with conviction. He has a the plan one behind it. Wait. Did the stage change? Let's see. Uh, let's see. Three, Battlefield? Two, Battlefield, yes. yep. One, so one thing... One thing, uh, that's... I've never seen this mind. matchup before. Like, like, Gooms got really, like, really strong conversions at first, but he was missing, like... He was just unable to kill, kill Terry, so Venipang just was just allowed to have to go for so long. He took two stocks. I'm looking pretty hot right now. And if I miss the grab, get punished for it. Because he's really close behind, the favorite, favorite thing it is to do. Alright. It looks like they're just trying to poke away, now they're tentatively more safe. Yeah. These two characters can get away with very non-committal moves. Yep. I think Venifang's also aware of Yoshi's double jump armor. Oh! oh. The dog! Alright! Um, like I... in the one jump for whatever Yoshi's, whatever Yoshi's trying to edge guard you, that fair and massive, and they will kill you. The Yoshi also a very also heavyweight character, so power jump will kill it easily. Showcases that, nope. you know what, that maybe Garni out here should be playing... Uh... Oh, nice catch. Ooh, good call out. Uh, thing, bring it, keeping his head in the game. Oh, going, going for it. <laughs> edge cancel, like, the uh, egg. Can I do it? Power jump? This, this is actually kind of scary, though, if you ask me personally. Ooh, the yeah, inability yeah. to just actually completely invalidate that forward air. Lots of power dunks, better than this game. Oh, it catches the crack shoot. Just flanking through for Terry's projectile, but that's not matter because Terry will just jab and keep going at you. Get the pressure up. Is this best of three? Is this best of three still? Or are we in best of five yet? No, this is best of three. Oh, it's really early. And turn him and stuck. I can't miss him conversion. But he can, he can bring it back right here. Another upper, that's all he needs. Missing the upper. Oh, and now he has no now. Go. Yep. Power guys are like will go through Joshi. The game's just a little, little weary. His shield's looking a bit low. Gets in there. Nice parry just to get out of pressure. You know, Ben can't shield both Joshi. Yep. Only third in the game can't do that. But you can shield both Terry, doesn't quite get it there though. Got the crack shoot. And Yoshi being a heavyweight, he won't die super easy to a Buster Wolf or Power Geyser, but uh, you'll, be surprised. you'll be surprised. That's true. Last 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 game he just did Buster Wolf two times. Oh, oh both the Rizek doesn't get it. Venipank is stage control now. He has to get out of it. And the Gumes didn't seem to uh, Venipank can try to hold stage better. I think he just wants to get yeah, okay. That's why he did the last game. Nice. Oh, oh wait, that's it. Oh, oh that was very unfortunate. Oh dear. Okay. Benefit please on the ground five. Can okay, everyone in the chat please just press F yeah. for legumes? Here. Well, he's going to jail now if he evades taxes. I don't know. I don't know if Yoshi can write to write to people in prison though. I don't know if he's he can write. To Bro, have you seen his fingers? He has like four fingers instead of five. Yeah, what kind of dinosaur is he? I, I'm a bit, I'm knowledgeable on dinosaurs. I never seen a dinosaur like Yoshi. Uh, he's canonically named what was it? Yoshi Munch. Uh, I think it was Yoshi's story. Yoshi Munchy Munchy Koopas. Yoshi T Munchy Koopas, something like that. Now uh, Vanipang just dipped into the you. I know I don't I don't think shoes were meant in the age of dinosaurs, but I could be wrong. Maybe we haven't found it yet. Let's uh, check out the bracket. All right. Ooh, Mox is out. I'm by Lars. I'm back. Welcome Hello, Joe. back, Joe. And I lost to Grape. Oh, good. Yeah, okay. we, heard you, that, we heard you on the first game. We said you got Man very excited. <laughs> That's great. Beyond him is great. Yeah, I knew I was oh, kind of great. smurfing it up. Yeah, I yeah, figured. Right. I, oh, I, saw no he was playing, I saw he was playing Roy and Snake. And then when I saw him hop in the chat, I'm like, I recognize that thing. <laughs> <laughs> I called him out. 
Like, you're great. He's like, uh-oh. Oh, Gamer and Sassy. I, 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 I wish I could watch Gamer and Sassy. I want to see that. I want to see that matchup. Donkey Kong versus Pikachu. Opposite, yeah, opposite but, end uh, of the tier list. Production is, is also playing a match right now. So, uh, we're watching the set. We are going to get Monkey versus. Also, uh, we we got too much Monkey last. You know, like why you smash? Like I ran out of Monkey jokes because of we, the game. We did, are good. we did have a lot of monkeys. Yeah, we had what was it? Well, we had Big Monkey and we had. He's an small. ape. Yeah, uh, speaking of well, actually speaking of uh, monkeys, uh, because uh, uh, this person right here, Chokujo, he co-mains Pikachu and Diddy Kong, so he Diddy might go. Yeah, to the other yeah he's both on my bracket already. I, I, either way, I like both monkeys, and we're gonna. I see also, like one, we are going to see one monkey. Either I'm way. more I'm more of a reptile guy, but monkeys are okay. You, you this, get this bracket is going right very now. fast. We're in winner semifinal. Kong Gang only. I'm sorry. <laughs> as, gang. as the prophets say, return to monk. <laughs> How's this set going so far? Well, the set hasn't started yet. The set has <laughs> not started. How was the last one? The one that I missed. The last uh, one. I've been playing too well, like you. It was pretty good. It was. It was, it, it was pretty pretty good. The one thing was like legumes, even though he was sh moving, he was unable to get kills on Terry. And you know yeah. what happens when you are unable to get kills Terry on Terry? Terry killed you in Soviet Russia. Yeah, Terry you know, where's, where's Terry from again? South, South America. King of no, what, what part of the world is he from? He's uh, he's American, isn't he? Yeah. Oh. Well, I'm not sure. I mean, the way he's talking, he's just broken English. Right. Like Tyler, Anyways. right? Like, like you might know going into the match with another peak. Miriam like Miriam playing a second peak. No, 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 no. He's Italian, right? Terry Bogle? I believe uh I believe Terry's... his brother is canonically Italian. Italian. I, I don't know. His his song's name is Pasta. I, I don't I think, know. Yeah. yeah. Alright, so Marion's gonna have to fight another Pikachu in bracket. We're the, going he does against the match of knowledge of the head, but see. His Pikachu is looking very different from the last moment we saw. Motless E Jolts. So far, yeah. Uh, He's also so, wearing Curry's hat. Yeah, actually. Uh, so one thing you want to mention anything about Tyler about this, this, this Pikachu that's different from the other one? Anything you notice? Anything I notice? Uh, a lot less buttons being pressed. Uh, oh, for sure. Not Pikachu Libre. It's not Pikachu Libre. Yeah, this one is indeed a male Pikachu. Yes, sir. And. Uh, a so we, we, believe in, so you know, we believe in general equality here at YU Smash. You know what that different. means? That means that there's a type advantage. Oh, we already went through this. <laughs> I'm looking pretty even right now. Yeah, but like, Pikachu sucks for Tigger Ninja. That's like, fucking nuts. Yeah, well, they're both- Well, one's wearing Red's hat and one turns into Ash. Oh, I wait. don't. Ooh, Marion Air. Oh, Marion's hat. Oh. Yeah, Pikachu Pikachu is going to be really tough for, for Ninja to to get back on stage here because it's a multi-hit. Mm. It's going to be hard to know when, when timing is to take the stage. Yeah, my Derek? team always goes to shit whenever the match is going on. Alright, so it is very even. Marion rolling to the side of the stage. Not sure why he did that and getting back aired off side of the stage. Looks like... Mm -hmm. These yeah. backers of Pikachu, they actually pick up greens on a shield, so if he does any any dash attacks on shield, then Pikachu can punish him. Oh, that, yeah, sounds, be... that sounds terrible, and I would <laughs> yeah, have to do it. That is one the reason why I was saying earlier when, when Marion was fighting Sassy, the other Pikachu player in this tournament, was mm -hmm. that for Sassy, I would just be spamming backer like every single day of my week, 24-7. They, you know, they, 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 they were they were spamming all right. <laughs> That's one of yeah, Pikachu's no, best moves for sure. More of it. More of it. More. More. More back. It's a, it's a frame 5 move, so it's frame 8 out of shape. You know what? This sounds yeah. like my kind of character. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna make it over just back here. Ooh, oh, good are you bold, yeah. Wait, Tyler, are you bold? Am I what? Are you bold? Oh, good tech. Uh, are you bold? Bold. Yeah. My bald? No. no. I, I do have too much hair, and I. I, I'm sorry. I, I'm not gonna say <laughs> three between you. Only, right? only, yeah, only one not... man can play yeah, Pikachu, right? and that's E Sam. Yeah, only yes, sir. That's I was uh, as degenerate as I, as I I was scrolling through TikTok, and E Sam showed up on my TikTok feed, and I said, oh. "Why?" I am then I then uninstalled the application. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm, 
Thunder Drift. Anyways, getting back to the match at hand here. Pikachu, uh, grab your ledge you're and don't die. Right no, we're, 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 like, just, we're, all, we're just not going to talk about the match anymore. <laughs> <laughs> the no, damn, not going to that. Marion does get clipped with the down smash, getting sent out. For some reason, always going upwards with his uh, counter. Uh, it's just a follow up. Yeah. Does he get a follow up? What follow up does he get off of the upwards? Marion really likes the turret. I'm very really like the turret. Oh. Amazing catch with the shuriken. Snipe. Marion D sniper. Nair loops, nair loops, no nair loops. That could have been a free 80%. Yep. See, if there was oh, Easter right there, there. Yeah. I'm actually maybe, getting that. Maybe Chogojo's not bald. Yeah, 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 I agree. Well, we can find out after. <laughs> we just need to find out yeah. if he's bald, too. <laughs> he's, gonna shave, he's gonna shave in, in wait, the wait, Every two Pikachu pair. Every two Pikachu pair has to be bald now. There's no, no exception. Wait, did Sassy win his match? Sassy won one against Mary. But did he win the set? No. Nope. Okay, then we can no. confirm that he's not bald. Well, he did. He beat, he beat okay. me as well. He beat me in loser. Okay, well then, he grew hair after he beat you. <laughs> no, no, no. Is he gonna lose it again? If he, is he gonna lose the hair again if he loses this next set? So he shaved after he lost to Marion. That's how it works. All right, so Marion definitely can take he this a back. He has a razor on hand. Yeah. After every second, I wear he shaved or not. So I personally, I believe Marion definitely can take this. All he would have to do is get get one of those cool confirmations that he likes practicing on his stream. He yeah, actually goes off page, just not oh. get the tech. Very scary situation for him. That was techable though. I got Shadow see the red. Shadow sneaks back to the stage. Of the oh, and catches him with the Shadow sneak again. Amazing. Very good. Slide. Expecting, Slide on them. expecting nothing less from the Marion. The the now duo duo main. I can't say the Greninja main anymore. It's weird. Why? What? What does Rude. duo main? Pal what does Palutena? Yes. Well, the Palutena is just some cheesy counter pick. He did yeah, well, indeed pop out the Palutena. That's right. Palutena, Palutena is secondary. Cheesy counter he, pick. He did pop out the the Palutena against uh, the Game and Watch earlier. Forgive me for oh, oh. forgetting the name. I uh, I missed that match. Okay. Oh, we have a character switch. Diddy Kong against Gideon, and now we will see Monkey versus Frog. And you know, this, be really bad, bad, this would be a really bad matchup in real life because the chimp can just step on the frog and win with one hit. But that's not the case here. Well, that's this a chimp. Frog's this chimp be. has an Nintendo cap. He is, this chimp is sponsored. <laughs> Unlike the rest of us playing Smash Bros. Damn. Uh, yes, to speak for yourself, <laughs> Marion is indeed does have a Raid Shadow Legends link. Right. Oh, good. Which he will tell you about it every but night. Does he, does he have a, a TikTok? Uh, probably. No, that's cringe. I'm just kidding. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the instant. All right. So yeah, we're getting back. Got who, who makes clothes? Dude, who makes clothes for Donkey Kong characters? Like, do they have a who, who sews like a shirt and cap for a chimpanzee? They make it themselves. But yeah, they, they have thumbs. You think they? You think they know how to make clothes? That's not an easy thing. You think a real gorilla can punch the moon? No. How do you get? How do you get a nice version? Killing no off the after about. talking about nonsense. All right. So I just say one thing. Right? Yeah, I'm, I'm trying Listen, to my, my, stream is, my stream is like, I'm only barely keeping up here. All, All I right. know is that Choco so, Joe's down his pocket. So going back to the match, Marion is doing a very good job about uh, keeping his lead. Keeping center yeah. stage, only throwing out attacks when he knows they're going to hit. Seems Man, looking, looking worse for Choco Joe in game one. I think, I think maybe he should have stuck to the Pikachu. Ooh, getting that nice grab. Just tacking on all the way. Yeah, Mary is just Mary is not it's there was not very much, good. Just over 100% uh, on his first dodge. Attack as the grenade in this matchup is such a just a good pressure. Just dash attack, dash attack, dash attack, dash attack, dash attack. Just that's just why a I like this. Yeah, that's why I like. You know, the thing is, like, like Diddy is a character that wants to get issue to shield with his banana, but Greninja is a character that stop moving. Also, dash attack can catch banana. So something to be aware of. Like literally, one of the Greninja's best yeah. options will also catch banana. I think we catch banana. Like, that because I think we went to best option. You know, he has to play around it. Yep. Very good. Not gonna kill if you park. Oh, nice! That nice one is gonna kill. 
Like, Shark Witcher tried to escape, but Mary said, no, no, you get back here. Can we talk about how Mary, great that Mary, was? Just yeah, how maybe like, amazing type. that was from the full haunt. Just down in, scooped him with the forward arrow center stage, right. and just gone. Scoop! Hey. He, may be a fire, Scoop. he may be a water type. Hey. He's playing with fire right now. My man, Very good, look at that Very man. moving on this game. Beautiful. Hearing another Pokemon pun for a joke from our, from, uh, from production. Saying Very it's a, pro a protein, it's a protein Greninja actually. I, I, I probably, probably with Life Orb. Yeah, probably with Life Orb. Mean, that's not gonna do it. Coco Joe. Oh god, he got a choice oh, card. Yeah. Choice card to death. <laughs> My, my oh, man, my oh, oh, oh my god, oh. that was okay. Whoa. Wait, wait, wait. wait. He's, he's coming alive oh, again. Ooh, just throwing away the banana. Nobody needs it. Who needs a banana? Man, well, oh, he's, never mind. Mind. He's, the banana. he's here, and he's here to play. That's my turn, came with that attack. It's only a it was kind of woken up a bit. God, Let's this see if magic. we can make it, make it count. Ooh, oh, that right. banana almost pretty so scary. Good. I want to move it. Okay, ledge. Very neutral oh, center. Cool. Oh, he wanted he want a horn air, I think, but you got a banana. Joe, what do you think oh, right now? Ledge. Who, who, do you, think... who do you think can pull the better neutral? Uh, Never mind. No way. Never mind. No. A little greedy down tilt. You can't be down tilt and giddy. Like the that. comeback from Coco Joe. Very impressive. Yeah, that was so a good I was wrong about the Diddy Kong. Maybe it was the right pick after all. Diddy Kong doesn't struggle with short characters because Banana like hits very low. Oh no, I didn't, I didn't say that. But the, the, um, for most of the match, he was behind and he sort of just woke up and was able to take it back from Marion. Yeah. Especially Banana out of shield is going to be huge because it controls the ground a lot. And that's what he's sure. really good at. Oh, jumping right back into it. No stage pick, nothing. These guys, these guys want, to be, want to be over with. Yeah. Straight back into it. They both. Is this the best of three? Uh, let me see. Yeah, best five five. Win, winner's semifinals. This is the best five. We're going to fight Great, aka Peon Man 2. Great, oh, that'll be interesting. Oh, I mean, oh, that'll be interesting. Man's nutty. Yeah. Alright, man, yeah, man, man. Really man. He has a page on Smash Wiki. There's it a monkey. I didn't, see many, I didn't see many monkey flips from Coco Joe, and there was one right now. Yeah, Mary has a shield a lot. That's He's... normally the answer to shield. That's right. Yeah. Coco Joe looking much better right now. No. Oh, very good setup. Wants for the man. Does not get it. With nice parry. Oh. Up tilt's a kill move once you have high enough percent. It's really, really... Yeah, Diddy up tilt kills. Diddy up tilt kills for some reason. I'm not sure why. This is, thing, this is a thinking where something or a character sleeping makes people die, but... Who am I in judge? Grinja is huge percent deficit right here. But the thing is, like he can he can bring it back. Uh, oh, can, oh, you fell out. Oh, that, 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 that will be an ultimate moment where a character falls out of multi hit because they were programmed them. Obviously, didn't test them enough. No, this, this is very impressive. Smash Bros. Four those, man. There we go. Oh, oh, oh I felt, uh, that felt a little bit BM. Coco Joe yeah, is not feeling really good right, right now. A little BM. Down, oh my! I've never seen that before. Down uh, throw. Down here. How I know. Move Tyler then. We would have got her down there because because Banana was there, and if we downed him into the Banana, it would have been more percent. But it didn't work out. That was a very good idea though. Marion drops into the banana, can you make it back? Yes, it, you can. it always scares me with how deep Marion goes there. Because I don't know. I, I keep right, forgetting yeah, that. Marion yeah, basically has Pikachu recovery. You got the double. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I keep forgetting that Greninja can actually recover that. Yeah. Doing a lot of these dash attacks. Getting sent at a weird angle. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's just. That's oh, just oh! That was almost it. Yeah, that's only, only, only combos once it puts him in the tumble. Very good. Alright, Marion's got the banana. Yeah, but he has a lot of work to do still. Look what Joe. Not quite done yet. He could definitely do this if he does play it slowly. Yeah. You just gotta be doing a lot of those as with As we were saying with the attack he said, Marion's very good when he plays at his own pace. 
I actually, I actually disagree. I think that Marion has to make a play here because Diddy is gonna like, if you play the long game, Diddy's gonna win. Yeah, that's true. I think he's just definitely gotta get the whip. Oh, oh, because, oh, he he tried to go for the Falco. He tried to go <laughs> yeah. for melee Falco. Nice job. Yeah, what? Oh, sorry, that that's melee. My bad. Yeah. God <laughs> damn, I got melee on the brain. Oh. Probably because Marion's schmoving right now. Yeah, Marion's going a little more aggressive this time. Look at that. Okay. No, let you. Very good. See that that deep banana he screwed him over. He definitely they both, they both did play at his own pace and definitely did catch up in stock. So now, oh, all right. Here. Diddy can make that back. Yeah. yeah he he got got oh, down oh, oh, oh my goodness. Oh, my <laughs> fortunate. That was a very fast Very good combo. Oh. I'm, sorry. I'm sorry, but I have to report this stream as mature audience only. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have to do it. Right M. I'm or sorry. M. Sure. Close your eyes, children. That's better. Close that, your that, eyes. Hurt, that hurt me. You know, I know kids aren't watching this. We're not very fam we're not very family friendly. <laughs> that was that was actually a very good um, knowledge of character by Choco Joe. Mm -hmm. A banana throw off ledge allows you to combo Nair Dare. And Diddy Dare is extremely caught. strong. Yeah, Diddy Dare is like one of the strongest downers in the game for no reason. He's a monkey, a little monkey. Hey, they're pretty they're strong. Stronger than Donkey Kong's Dare. Little monkey, they could. Yeah. Well, we've heard DK has, DK has, what is he, have four spikes? Yeah, but none of them is strong as Diddy's there. Yeah, but, the, well, I guess quantity over quality? Yeah, that's probably it. <laughs> Anyways, into this then, Choco Joe one, one game away from moving on to winter finals. Oh, oh downer? Oh, I thought he was going to go for another one. One's never enough. Another one, yeah. Nice. Oh, that was it. Oh, I he looked for it. He looked for it. He looked for it. Yeah, he fumbled it. He just did nothing. I know you want to winners finals, but you, my man, you need, you need to chill. Because this is what happens when you don't take a chill. Still pill. Marion's doing really good at keeping the pressure on here. Even when he whips the move, he's still not done. Yep. That elf tilt ledge is very active, so it's going to cover a lot of options. That's what we saw before when he had to close up the stock at like 180. I agree. Also, this is not this is not gonna be as car as cops. Uh, why use my stream without one of the computers randomly leaving? So, uh, Tyler, please take over me completely. I need to get something to eat because I've been here since the start. All okay. right, it's, I, I'm still here. I didn't leave, and it's time for Daniel to leave. Farewell, everybody. Farewell. So, All right. Nice. Now we're going back to even stocks. Uh, Marion. Sitting in center stage with Choco Joe sitting at the ledge, threatening with his banana. Oh, nice banana conversion. Off the dash. Did he already eat the banana? You only got the peel left. Always got the peel. Okay, all right. <laughs> I am glad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that very down tilt. Did he fair on shield landing? Not very good. And that's the they only are... way you can hit a uh, green on the ground is when you do landing pairs. Mm -hmm. They are definitely just taking turns kind of hitting each other. And it's great. <laughs> I love it. Marion. Ooh, ex actually, Marion's. Marion's not not letting Choco Joe take his turn. Choco Joe looking for more nares at ledge. He knows that he needs something big here. That's great. Did he do not want to take, take stocks quickly? Not without a read, no. Or we're going to down our ledge. Like, that's kind of Pretty all much. Not one of those cheeky that's downers. Someone like, like, that's someone like really cheesy stuff. Yeah, otherwise it's a very slow burn. You're gonna have to outplay your opponent on like a lot of fronts. Ooh, look at that's this. Cool back. Oh, he went for it. Nice. This is just I super safe that Joe. He went for it here. Oh, oh my god. Oh, that was kind of swag. Marion is fighting. Marion, Marion always got it. You already know Marion's saying slide right now. Slide. He didn't hear him on the, on the screen, but he said slide. All right, he two, definitely two. did indeed say slide. Okay, boys, who do we think is going to take the W today? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I think it's going to be close. It's going to be a close. Like, game. are we going to see a stage switch? They're playing FD for a while. No, now. we're definitely going to see FD Diddy Greninja. I can't wait to see 
F the Diddy Greninja again. Yeah. Yeah. It's riveting, riveting gameplay. It's actually pretty good gameplay. They're both very aggressive. Oh, for sure. Just, I want to see Chogojo playing a little bit of more of a slow game and not going for these, these dares. Yeah, oh, I think yeah. he's trying. Like I think he's trying, he's trying to keep it at Marion's pace, but Marion's just outpacing him. Yeah, Marion's Marian, no, no, Marian. better at this fast-paced gameplay than. Yeah, and Grinja uh, can pull up stocks faster than Diddy yeah. Kong can. I, I actually, I actually can't agree with that. Marion oh. has been playing a very. He's actually been playing slower than he usually oh. does. Speaking of he's slow, been, he's been keeping a little bit more. Uh, what's the word? Uh, he, he's been a bit more patient, you know. And he's been a bit more, all right, I'll let you approach. And then also, I'm going to... Oh, back I'm here, back to Pikachu. Hits. I'm just going to get game, him. Man. Once again, last game. Pikachu. Last game is set Pokemon Bound on Kalos Pokemon League. Mm. <clears throat> I guess he only picked Pikachu because Kalos. That would make sense because... Yeah, it's, it's yeah. apparently Pikachu's Thunder best stage ever. Yeah, Thunder Jolt to ride because up the wall. Because there's so much space to toss out the Eagle. And because you can't give him, like this stage... Yeah, there's um, no way you can... Yeah, everyone's gonna live for so long, so the only way you can really kill is when you knock someone off stage far enough they can't come back, but Pikachu having like a really good recovery, possibly the best in the game, he's always gonna make it back. I would say it's the best. Alright, Marion. Top three. Yeah, I don't know what's that. Oh, I'm well, I should remember this set, I think it was a glitch where Dark Wizzy, E Sam. Dark Wizzy got like four special edge guards, E Sam still made it back just with just with the uh, quick attack alone. So I don't know. Could be. But anyways. Yeah, these Thunder Jolts riding up the stage are going to help him out a lot. And then... So far I looking good for Choco Joe. Two ninjas in up the Thunder percent. Or up to a Thunder percent. Could Possibly if Pikachu doesn't have much. Yeah, I think, I think so. If Choco Joe wants it, like, now might be a good time. He's going for an up smash. Doesn't get it. Yeah, it was, it was uh, two ninjas behind him. Oh, Ooh, there's... Getting a little bit greedy there with that dash in. Yeah, Chubbs are not awesome. going to be afraid to play all the way on the edge of the here. Not even playing on stage. Just well, Pikachu, why, why would you? You have a, such a long range recovery. Oh. You have to now oh. Why would you play on stage? You can skip edge grind completely thanks to that same percent recovery. The Marion's going to go. Marion's going to do the thing where you Marian stay. Marion just took all three of those. He's just taking. Tags, no tags. Not tech. Tech. Like a little Pokemon is very comfortable off stage here. He is. At ledge, especially. And Pikachu, like, Pikachu hold wall jump? Yes. Yeah, of course he does. <laughs> he does everything. Nice back air. Putting Marion on the corner. There's not much Greninja can do to, to pressure Pikachu here. No. Chocojo's Choco counter pick is working out for him quite well. Yeah. Because Greninja is like really strong on stage, but Chocojo's saying, I'm not going on stage. Chocojo's just play. throwing. Chocojo's <laughs> just throwing at hitboxes and Marion just keeps somehow running into him. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely. Yeah. Chocojo looking excellent right now. He just has no reason to even go near no, stage. No, he has no reason to be on stage. Yeah. He can run the timer if he wants. Oh, nice Amazing. Nice he's not playing Sonic, but he could do it. Marion showing that he still got the chops. He still want to yeah. be in this. Yeah, yeah, yeah they're losing somebody out now. Oh, alright, alright. Yeah, Grinja will do double. Doesn't quite get it. Choco Joe not realizing that he switched characters and is now playing Pikachu. <laughs> Time to go for the double dare again. You have to go for the double dare. Oh. 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 So where are you going? That was a, that was a critical that was hit. That was a good bat was playing for. Choco Joe takes over here in 3 2. That was a very good set. Yeah, that was Choco Joe's game. Seeing a lot of, seeing a lot of good stuff tonight. Once he gave Pikachu Kalos and a good game plan, then he knew exactly what he was doing. Alright, let me see how the bracket's doing. There's been a lot, I feel like there's been a lot of upsets tonight. Like Tantaco's already out. Uh, Lent Bryant's out. Mox is out. I don't think that was an upset by Mox. <laughs> Let's see, Mox versus Lars? Mm -hmm. I think it's close, but yeah, Lars takes it. Okay, now we're gonna go to an ad break. For Ray Shadow Legends? Not Ray Shadow Legends, no. <laughs> For our sponsor.
special thanks to York University Student Center. They're once again helping us run this tournament with advertising and with prize money for the York University students. They've been great working with us and we thank them very much. Links for their stuff is in the link in the description below. Uh, you can follow them on Instagram, on Twitter, Facebook. I know they've been using Twitter more. We don't have it up here, but they just started using Twitter again. And also on, of course, usc.ca for York students. It's it's mainly for York students. For those of you that aren't in York, then probably not much for you there. But well, we are very even, grateful. Even if you're just on campus, like let's say that you're, you're there for the tournament or you're a Seneca student even, it's a yeah. nice place to chill, nice place to... Yes. Go for go for the weeklies and go for well, the tournaments. Well, when we can go back to it, but that's not important right now. Yeah. Yeah. Whenever things open up again, it would be so nice. But back to the tournament. So Sass E is going to fight Venom Fang in losers round five. Yeah, we're waiting on. Well, I guess and we can Grape's get going... Coco Joe versus versus Grape on stream yeah, now. I'm Coco excited to watch that. Me too. I wonder, I guess he's going to go Snake? Or I think he's going to try out his Roy. I don't think he's, he doesn't want to go Snake. I think he wants to practice his Roy here. But he also doesn't want to lose. Well, he is also Probably. under a completely different name, so it doesn't really matter. That's right. Mm. Don't, no one knows I mean, this is Grape. He, he should have gone like Pear knew, or something. Or Pomegranate. I knew, I knew because I want to I wanna beat Grape. I really want to beat Grape because at one point in time, I think we were close to each other's skill level early in Ultimate. And then he just got way ahead of me and, and got like PR and everything. And then where where is he from again? Is he from uh, around he's here? In Toronto. Is... Toronto. Yeah, he's he's regular yeah. at waves and all the local tournaments. Uh, I think the the one waves I went to, I'm pretty sure he was there. Mm -hmm. I wonder if Choco is gonna go first. Uh, I'm guessing he's gonna go Pikachu. Oh, well, I don't Momentum. think. I don't think he considers me a rival, but I consider him a rival because I want to beat him really badly. I was so glad that I found out that was him. I have a goal to work towards, definitely. Very good. Mm. Joe, yeah. I believe in you. And one day, soon, you're definitely going to get it. Because you are cracked. <laughs> I'm cracked. <laughs> you are insane. Production coming in, I'm just saying I don't believe in him. Production coming in <laughs> saying that he definitely does not believe in him. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm working All for right. it. I'm working definitely, to... You're definitely putting in work and doing a great job. I did for bring sure. up the game five, but once they brought up the snake, I think that was it for me. I can't handle the snake. I mean, I wasn't doing terribly, but it's it's just on another level. Mm -hmm. And I'm not there yet, but it's a goal to reach for. You'll get there. As long as you keep putting in the work with your work ethic, we, we all definitely, including production, believe in you. <laughs> I, I believe in me too that I can get better. I think the, the struggle here is that I have to get better faster than he's getting better. You know? So I can't control his rate of throw, and that means that I need to like move quicker than he is, and I don't even know how quick he's moving. So I think that's, 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 that's where that's the real fair. struggle comes in. Because I, I definitely have gotten a lot better since uh, the beginning of quarantine. I think it's very oh, noticeable. Definitely. But. Marion has definitely yeah, Marion, been... Marion also a player that's been improving a lot recently. Correct. And also, he hasn't performed today, but LeBryant has also been improving a lot. Taking some good games, especially when he switched to Sephiroth. I think that's where we noticed a big uh, big change in his growth as a player. I, I, think, I think his growth is also directly linked to the fact that he's decided to play other games. You think so? Uh, yeah, I think I think him him playing Tekken and playing melee definitely has improved his uh, his neutral and his uh, his spacing and his uh, the way he actually looks at both of the games. It may not be conscious to him that that that's what's happening, but for sure, playing other games in my, my opinion and uh, from what I've spoken with a bunch of other people, that if you do play other games you will most certainly improve by bringing over the fundamentals from the, from said other games. Mm. And I he's been playing play multiple games. He's been doing a good job. I think, especially if, if you're thinking about, I think especially if you're thinking about Smash while you're playing those other games, right? Yeah, yeah, you're for like, sure. Hmm, this looks like a situation that I recognize in Smash. And then you go and, and you, you apply it to Smash, right? You're like, now I know how to deal with this. 
through another game with other tools and, and everything. It's just a different coat of paint, you know? Yeah, yeah. Like, I was and recently watching game. this podcast where these players were talking about chess. Play. And then... All right. Yeah. Sorry, Joe. talking about chess, and then it was like, okay. With a uh, star peon to... man. Star peon man, too, <laughs> whatever that means. That, that's an asterisk. That means that that's just... Uh, no. uh, I mean, you'll it's a Dragon a Ball star. reference. It's, got it's a not ball. a Dragon Ball reference. What's, what's a peon? No, no, the, the asterisk... If you, if, you, if you look for it, turn on safe search just to be safe. All right, anyway. into the match. Exactly. Yeah, anyway. so, so C4 is already on the middle platform. He has middle stage control. I think Chocodo is aware of that. So Chocodo is playing a passive. No. Yeah, great. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna call him great. Great just starting out. Great. 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 This is Snake God Great, and he's not pulling up the Roy this time. <laughs> snake God Great. Oh no, they're just sitting there. Is this a lag test or? No, this I... can't be. He's just sitting there. Mm. Snake's wondering too. He's got I'm, it. Just I'm gonna, I'm gonna there. Let's see if they're chatting. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check that. Oh yeah, it might be lag test. So it's like lag test. So this is terrible. That's it. That's what Creep said. Ooh, yikes. Oh. Mm. Okay, well, we're gonna we're gonna run through the lag test stuff. So this is gonna be a bit of a break. Um. While we are on break, I will be right back to fill my water. Don't forget to stay hydrated, everybody. I also need... Yeah, we're, we're gonna take them off stream for now. Pikachu wins! I'll tell them to test the speeds first. Okay. So I got a match to play. So I'll let TOK hold it down. No, thanks. <laughs> okay. Looks like we're gonna have Joe Store versus Gifka. Joe Store plays a wolf, Gifka plays a Rob, but looking at bracket I didn't see he pulled out Ike to fight Gideon and took over it took it over him through three one. Um but I'm very certain he'll be going to go and get uh Rob again. And Joe, I'm not I'm not sure I think Joe has beaten Rob so far. I'm not sure how too familiar he is with the matchup. I know I think um, he thinks Rob not, is a top tier. Not very familiar. I'm I'm not not good at that matchup. No. And we have a few Robs in Ontario. We have Gipka, we have Jams. Uh, I believe, I'm pretty sure we have more, they're not getting, hitting my mind right now, but those are two that come to mind right away. Yifka is, uh, as a peer at York, York's before, he, he was at our locals before quarantine. Jams, I think, is from a little farther. I don't quite know exactly where he's from, I'm not, I don't travel much around the city. For who? For Jams. Jams? Uh, yeah, he's from like Waterloo. Waterloo, okay. Oh, actually, yeah, I I read some more though. Okay, so what Marion said, but you can hear him, is he's originally from Alberta, but he goes to school in Waterloo. And his name is actually James, I believe. I think he just took the E <laughs> out and left, left with Jams. Yeah. Also, another notable thing about him that people bring up is that he wears, um, he wears Work gloves club? while he plays. Yes, I did. I, I was looking at his match week page today. It's coming back to me. And I think his, he had a tag, what was it, Attack Plus 15? Which is something from Maple Story, I believe. I've not played that series, but apparently wearing gloves in that game gives you um, a stat buff, and that's sort of a tag he wore when he was playing. Yo, I can't he he right plays in every time. game. From Maple Story. Oh. Uh, Maple Story, you, you, put, you put scrolls on your equipment, then you can just get a plus, plus whatever in a stat. Yo, I'm actually not wondering if he, I'm guessing he's wearing more gloves right now. Can you take like, your light like test? So I don't want to hold up my set. Fudge. Alright. Great, send me the... Yeah, I'll leave you right now. We can let them play it out if they fix like the lag and stuff.
Okay, let me DM Tropico. Ben and Fang Sassy are going at it, currently 1-1. One, one. I'm gonna... No, wait, 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 I'm doing it like this. Okay, well, it's within 10. Actually, Grapes is Grapes is 15 above. Like he's he's actually significantly more. He said it was really stuttery. Mm. No, it's it's not close. Grape Grape has better Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi like a lot. You just tell him to play in, in a separate arena. I don't tell him that. And if it's still laggy, yeah. Okay, so... <laughs> a little bit of a hiccup here in, in running the tournament. Uh, it happens sometimes. There's Red Dig with Nintendo Online. Which we do pay for. Yeah. 25, 25 bucks a year, Canadian dollars. It's something like that. It's, it's not too much. Yeah, I mean, it's better than I think. I think PS, PSN, PS Plus is like 50 a year, probably more. So I think it's still, pricing is okay, but I yeah, do but wish the numbers were better. Yeah, the, 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 they, the net fo the net code for their games and the amount of multiplayer the games they have is it, it's so it's reasonable. Yeah, of course it's proportionate, right? You're, what kind of bank? And Nintendo has well, they have Mario Kart, they have Smash, they have on stream. Off that train of thought. Right. Is, is Grape still in the arena? No, Grape's gone. That's right, sick. Gift cards waiting for you. <laughs> Coming. Okay, let me send Marion what I said. Okay. Now I can get back to smashing brothers. Oh, well, you're smashing a robot, okay. <laughs> He's one of the brothers. Well, I would say robots have gender, but I don't want to get into that conversation. <laughs> you can be a robot too, but... Regardless of gender, alright? That's true. They don't, they don't have Very gender. True. Well, not that I know of. Unless someone assigns it. Alright, let's, let's not get into... I don't know how Let's not get into... Yeah, we're not, not, not in the Transformer server right now. Anyways, I wonder what the first stage will be for this. It's probably PS2. PS2. Oh, I don't know that yet, but I'm assuming. It isn't always it's PS2. It's PS2. Let's go. Easy. Do you think, do you think when we get small mouth, it'll be legal? Okay. I feel like I'm gonna I feel we're pump. missing on the hunting small battlefield here. Wish me luck, wish me luck. Good luck. Good Ready. luck, Joe. Ready? Alright. Gifka rocking the virtual boy of Rob Colors. Alright. Red versus red. We're gonna see Joe really good wolf. One. And uh, uh, really good Rob. Let's since our our boy Daniel's gone. Really, really, like really Joe's off. aware of the gyros. I think he's gonna recover from that easily. Install a ledge. Hopefully, it's not the whole game. All right. So Thanks. the notes that we do have on Gifka is that 
Besides, besides. That he's a known as a York Slayer. So I'm assuming that means yes, uh, yeah, definitely. that anybody in York you can just kind of kind of snipe out of the tourney, and is known for great great setups and loves going for. I, I'm going to assume that means off stage for edge runs. But with Rob, but that's Rob a, specialties. Yeah, with Rob, that just sounds like. A, I believe. No one has the gyro. Yes, he does have the gyro, and he's not going to get anything off of it. If he only has 24%, it was a huge deficit to make back here. I think Joe might want to use more laser, but drop his one scarce and go very high and stall very high. Joe's sitting center stage, basically allowing Gift to come back. Yeah. Gift is kind of comfortable in the corner there, I think. And where's. Yo is, I think is a little too scared of the gyro. He's constantly pulling reflector, but he's not really getting like he has it. I think he's trying to get something off of it, but Gift Cut sort of expecting that. I think Gift is playing into his fear of the gyro. For sure, I for think, sure, yeah. I think maybe Joe should try just tossing it up because if you toss gyro up, Rob can't use it until it comes down, he spawns, or he grabs it. If you just toss it, uh, Rob just goes away and Rob can get it back. Oh, it'll be very good. Joe with the obligatory nice back That's air. Right. You're very good. Yeah. One of his. Wolf's best That's move. Insane. Something Wolf. Something Joe's very good at landing. Gets link. Fair in there. Fair. Starting to see a bit more confidence in Joe, I think. But Gift Cut gets out smash out of shield once more. Joe very good, seems... Very good actually with the gyro. Seems to be floundering a little bit, trying to catch Gift Cut. Yeah. Trying to catch up to his pace of, uh... Yep. This, this seems to be a running away, getting, uh, getting these hits yeah, in. Yeah, Gift Cut's kind of controlling the pace of the match very well. Yep, he seems to be... Joe's... A little stuck on trying to trying to reach his fences. When he does get in, he can't seem to get too much off. I think he's just wearing a Rob's there. And well, the fact that Rob again can just go high, fastball in there, or use a bear and space him out. Like he's he's very aware of the options, but he just doesn't know how to get around them. As good as Gifka is at controlling the pace, Joe is really one of the most adaptive players I've seen, to be honest. Oh, for sure. And he's, again, uh, he's very very. very and I definitely, think definitely he is. Might want to try more run and grabs? I see Gifka shielding quite a bit, but Gifka also jumping too. I'm not, I'm not quite sure. I'm not, I'm not playing a ton of robs myself, but I do see Gifka shielding long game. I say that gets spot dodge shield now. But I might hold it for you. Good tag on the... Oh! Gifka was expecting that. We got 1-1. One, one. Looking back for Joe at first, but he's back to one stock apiece. Let's see. It's only game one, and when he has plenty of time to adapt, just being used to support finals. Joe definitely has been adapting at a very fast pace, yeah. just slowing down and making, basically think, just, just taking any hits that that come his way. And honestly, they've been they've been taking him, they've been taking him the miles. I wonder, I wonder if he wanted to land the platform the up throw. I, I, but I'm not quite sure. I'm not sure what he would go off of it. I think probably the up throw fair, but it's not as useful as the down throw comes. But anyways, we have pretty close percents right now. Uh, Joe's still trying to chase him around. Gifka got in there. Back here. He was looking for the jump in, didn't get it. Joe definitely has yeah, been you know, doing you know, Joe's job. aware of up smash out of shield. He spaced that there better to avoid it. That drive once again sitting on ledge. Joe, oh dear. Again, Gifka clearly knows how to deal with people, how to read people from deal with Jarl on ledge. Gifka takes it game one. That was pretty good on Joe's part though. He started pretty bad, pretty caught up pretty well. I think he got choked at the end just because Gifka seems to know how to how to lead, uh, ledge trap with his gyro. Uh, I don't think, I'm, Joe will not switch, I think Joe's going to solo wolf and 30s so now, I don't think he'll play any other character. <laughs> the stage pick, I don't know, I think Rob's going to any stage, I don't know if Salt Rob has any bad stages, he's a pretty flexible character, like he was going back to PS2. So he, you know, just ignore me on that stage part. Anyway, we'll see what Joe was taking from game one, what he can apply to game two and beyond. Three, two, one, yep. Yeah, like go! definitely back to PS2. I think Joe did say before the match that he definitely wanted to just go straight to PS2, anyways. Yeah, it's a, it is a comfort pick for majority of multiplayer players. Very important to say, very digital stage. It's kind of big though. I don't even realize how big it is, but because of the platform layout and the flash zones, it just kind of just accepted it like a start on. The uh, bigger the stage, the better the uh, opportunity for neutral, in my opinion. I should have Gifka taken advantage of, and 
little too obvious that that's smash. Joe's Joe just opening up with a fair train, just pulling him yeah. back in center stage. Bob, crazy is, he's still a big body, he's still heavy, he's still combo food. Joe with a nice recovery, snapping straight to the head, but Joe. Gifka, I, I, again, Gifka just seems to know that Joe can stay. Last game, Joe was trying to deal with Jarrow differently, trying to avoid it, catch him up, smash. This is the back here just a little bit. Gifka seems a little hard trying to get away. Looking like last game already, gonna be like 80%. Joe's down a stock. Ooh, very nice drift away from Gifka, but it looks like looks like Joe definitely did Ooh, also just a drift. Force smash punish on the air force smash. Do they catch the jump out of the platform? I, I don't think I've seen. I haven't seen Joe grab too much this set. I guess another hand smash. I know. I see Joe go for you know the classic wolf down throw dash attack, but I've not seen this set. There's a dash attack, I'm just going to get it. Yifka can, controlling this match, I think a little better than last game, huh? Although, big percent deficit right now, but 8%. Alright, Joe definitely getting that whiff punish again. Trying Once to... Again, spot dodging. Ooh, ooh, it misses the up smash that time. He won the second one, that probably would've killed Rob, uh, Wolf. Let's get it. Joe knows where Yifka wants to go high. Rob's very good at stalling in the air. I think it was Bear and Dare stalling him. Yep. Moving, moving around. Bear essentially is going to do it. Gifka was just running away with this game. It looks like Gifka is just going to be trying to trying to play slow again. I'm seeing Gifka throw shoot. I'm seeing Gifka shoot laser though. He seems pretty good with Gyro, but I'm not seeing him play really shoot lasers that much. I'm not sure if he's saving it for like a mix up, maybe conditioning, long term conditioning on Joe to say not expect lasers because he's so used to Gyro's right now. We'll see. I'm not, I'm not seeing a ton of Gifka play. But I do know most, if not all, Rob's love easy charm playing, and he wanted the gyro there, did not get it. Up the up here, not gonna connect. Keep the punches in for trying to catch him. There's a grab from Joe. Four throw doesn't get much off of that. Probably a wolf first throw. If good, just comfy to sit back on the side of the stage. But there's a laser. See, you know, but Joe's ready for that. I think he knows that Rob might just really just off stage to cover their escape. How's Max gonna do it once again? Joe bringing it to one stock. Joe getting getting smack around a bit still. Definitely taking a little bit, taking way too much percent in this last stock. Can definitely just get get hit with a random smash, smash attack at the side of the stage, and probably just be the end. Off stage is looking very scary. I agree. Joe shining the very stationary gyro. Not sure, not sure why he would do that. But uh, definitely has turned into less of a chase and more of uh, Gifka also kind of now just throwing hitboxes out towards uh, towards Joe. Very cool. Look at this thing, Joe too. I think do a pack there. Get it there. The down throw, down throw up smash. Does that does that work on? It, it's it's a 50 50 kind of like a match or not it does work if that bear just gonna do it uh rob can do up so if you down throw up till up smash up bear kind of depends it's percent phase too but i think it depends on <clears throat> uh sorry production told me to hurry up in my food and i'm here now all right and we've got our third commentator back welcome back daniel did you enjoy your food it was tennis food yes i did enjoy it i was also watching raptors games Pretty good, pretty good Amazing. stuff. They know they're, they know they're playing tonight. Or is it, or is it just... I'm, I'm not into sports, so I apologize for my lack of knowledge on that department. Are you it's just watching the quarter? Both two no, very I was watching cool live. <clears throat> oh, okay. So, uh, Tyler, I wanted to ask you, what do you think Joe can do to improve uh, his game plan here? I think, uh, I think Joe... As much as Joe has been playing slow, and as much as he's been chasing Gifka, I think if he does... Just, if he just embraces the slow game, yes, and kind of just annoys Gifka enough to come. Oh, oh never mind. He's oh, playing. Oh, I was oh, oh, it's play. the opposite of what you're saying. It's oh, the opposite, the opposite, opposite of, of what I said. Play. He's gonna press the up B button. We'll see. Oh, B go brr. <laughs> up B out of shield. Fargo versus Epic Gabriel. I mean, Joe versus Gifka. <laughs> he just went straight to charging with it. Joe's done. Joe's done. He gave up. And he pressed the up B button. No, 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 no. He's winning this. He's Our winning this. Be more aggressive. 
I do think this is a good idea. Look at this well. usage of the upbeat. So much skill, so wow, so much skill, so much wow. Oh, what is that? Gosh, I, I sound like that crappy old like Dutch meme, you know? So much wow, wow. Wow. He, he seems to have thrown him for, for a bit of a loop, but Gip is quickly sort of freaking out. Joe definitely losing the confidence in the wolf after having to. I understand it, having to chase around another player, like a more mobile character, while you're playing yeah. a really slow, very like hard hitting character, it, it feels weird. And you lose a little bit of that motivation, and sometimes you just want to up you out of shield and just up you out of shield again, and then charge limit. And yeah, he, 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 because Wolf, Wolf is uh, good at beating Zora characters out, but I think the way Gifka's playing, he's not really giving that kind of. He's not going with that kind of. Uh, and counterplay, I should say. I think it's with Joe. Joe was uh, playing a little bit too too approach. Too approach you know? yeah. Yeah. Kind of playing like, to give his hands, I would say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Going That's in cool. a little bit too hard. Looking Ooh, much better right here. now. Like, I think now he has a sword. He can space in, space out uh, against that much better. Sword now. Definitely right. getting the weird hitbox on the up smash. That should have killed, but yeah. he was facing Rob's pretty around. heavy. Oh. No. oh, we died to that. Never mind. Oh, okay. Oh, see right. it first. Like start, uh, start kill. Joe, Joe saving the limit. He's looking pretty good this set right now. Definitely waiting. Oops, getting the limit. All right. Oh, oh that's hard read. Yeah, I don't think it was necessarily a read because the setup with the gyro. If you were to get hit by a gyro, he was gonna get go that way. Yeah. Okay, so we so conditioned it. Yeah. I think that man could, could just, oh. just, 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 just got the upper hand. Joe definitely looking like he's feeling himself. Also, a bit of lucky for Gip to not get a single trip right there. No, I know, I know what the trip, I know what that trip chances work in uh, this game. They, it just, it's, it's, it's a good chance. Right? It's a percent, is it percent face? Oh, he's trying to go for the finishing touch. Yeah, I saw that. He, he, I think he wants to put more confidence into himself. Jo well, yeah, Joe looking. definitely being a momentum player, definitely wanting to go for it. Yeah, we'll jump over the laser, okay. You say Gifka's starting to use the laser a bit more now than oh, before he wasn't using it at all. Oh, I just realized that. Gifka missing the easiest uh, spike to the whole game. <laughs> nice. Gets the back now. Down. It, it, it lasts for so long. It's so easy to run. Yep. Yeah, now it's laser team. Now laser's coming out and Joe's not as ready for it. I still old here. Ooh, oh, nice. oh, you, oh, he wanted he that so badly. Put him oh. in the grave there. Oh, the, oh. Dang. That side Real. Real. Oh, that side. Nice. Started pretty good, but I think he just kind of lost momentum there. Get to figure it out. Do you think, do you think uh, he should have stayed wolf for that one, guys? No. I think I think if he stayed wolf, he definitely would have had a better chance. Because, I'm uh, all about racing the Unga. Go yeah. Old, oh, old. Yeah, yeah. He would have. I think, he, I think he would have like a more knowledge accumulated with that character. Now, because I went to Cloud, now suddenly he's playing a different, different control, oh, yeah. different. Going, uh, sorry about that. Go, going Unga Bunga is definitely a good idea, but at the same time, Joe was adapting very well, mm -hmm. and uh -huh. you know Joe. Joe's one of those players who, if he he will sit down and he will grind a matchup, right? Yeah. But in that situation, I feel like. Just having a slow character, having to chase and chase around another character, you just get frustrated. And no matter how much you try to change your playstyle, they're still gonna run away and they're still gonna camp you. They're still gonna slightly float out of your range and taunt you, and that is infuriating. Yeah, I, actually, yeah. before this bracket, I was playing uh, Bioth against some uh, Palutena, and that was like what's happening. The slow character trying to chase on a fast one, and I got <laughs> a little tilted. But you're absolutely right. I think. I think next time he should, if he does this, it happens again. I think he should stay on Wolf. Don't go Cloud. It was a good idea, but it just didn't work out in the end. Get caught on to what he was trying to do and punish it accordingly. Yeah, definitely keeping it as a learning experience. For sure. And you got you got this you got the stream to look at, look back to see what he could do better. Well, I mean, even even just using the Cloud, that is also a learning experience. Yeah. But more so as in, you get. The, as, a, as much as you, get, wait, as right. much as you hate the matchup, you gotta practice it. You gotta what are you doing production? Right. Actually, you know what? Production, I believe in you. I trust you, production. Our production team is up now. <laughs> he, he's concerned why you're switching to Palu. 
<laughs> He's so, so our production completely ignoring everything I've just been saying. <laughs> oh, and Jojo and Jones, DQ. Great. Oh, that's that's understandable. That's understandable. Any production, right. I need to find his voice. I just, I just find it really funny how it was like, yeah, you should you should just practice your bad matchups, no matter how much you keep losing, and then immediately switch to Palu and says. Oh yeah, my Greninja's never won, so I'm just switching to Palu for this one. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I went, I went all Dark Tempest, and I, I switched to Lucina or Sonic or Pilot or anybody. Yeah, I mean, Man. yeah, for for this, you do have to, like, in this game, there's so many characters, right? So oh, sometimes, gosh, yeah. sometimes oh, you, worth, you really like, do like, have to switch. You really do have to switch a character just to fix a matchup. For sure. No, and if you're gonna practice, sorry, go on. And it, sorry, yeah, if you're gonna practice it, you gotta you gotta at least test the waters with different characters, right? Yeah. So with, with him testing characters, I if he's gonna dual main something just to cover the bad matchups, that's perfectly fine. For sure. Okay, like, I know... There's another last series. This has to be the last series, right? I think so. There's been like three of them in bracket. No, four of them in bracket today. Oh, Marion decides to just start playing Terry. I mean, what if I if you if he wants to do nothing stop him? I think you would play a very good Terry, Daniel. I know. I I, I love my Uga Booga. I play Incineroar. It's it's you you know. Mm -hmm. You know yeah. I'm all, 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 all about that. Anyway, but into anyway, the matchup. Uh just just starting Marian, match. Fresh tanking on Benefang showed a lot of game hunters for it. Benefang's pacing back and forth like he always does. He's very confident in this matchup already. Punches the cab, ledge, one corner of the getting, getting absolutely punished there. <laughs> now here we go. Oh, they clap. That was a what? air dodge. That was horrible. I don't know what happened there. Roll. He's down though back here. I think going high, they're going to explode his plane. That trips? Okay. Yeah, this, this character do be dog. Your neutral betrayal. These, are both, these are both dumb characters, let's be real. Yes, but one of them has green hair. Well, well, I, I think you say one of them is a waifu, but. I mean, Terry? That one is Terry. Yeah. Oh, back here. I think the other back here being a down threat. That's gonna do it, yes. But. Okay, so don't SD. Yeah, the. And then kind of cornered. Very important. No, I'll miss the follow up. Dash attack? That's, gonna, that's not gonna do it at all. I think that was a weak hit. I think strong hit can take it down. If I'm fine. Oh, dash attack? This is shoulder bash him. Looking pretty risky. Oh, yep. Yeah, he went for it. Up. It's, it's yeah, out of it. I'm gonna find out how that work in this game still. And just like that, Venom Punk is just 2 1 up and stuck. So it's pretty comfortable. Yeah, track shoot, fresh train, jab jab. Like, just piling all the damage. Oh, just went for a grab. Interesting. I think Mary needs to slow down with the dash attacks here. He's going for lots of them. He's, that one worked okay, but I've seen Benefic Hunter so many. I think he should, might want to do many more fairs. No, Benefic likes to roll, which likes to roll in. That's it. No tech there. No tech zone. <laughs> Yikes. Okay. That was only game one of three. Potentially five. Minimum okay, three times five. Uh, is this versus five? Production, can we get a confirmation? It is a best of five. Okay, okay, all right. So, so Marion can afford to throw two games before he actually decides to try. That's okay. Marion special. He I go, is he going to go back to the, the frog? Choose your fighter. Ice Ice climber. Ah, oh, there it is. is. Oh, nah, he's trolling. Okay. Oh, no, no ice is too late. Uh, for a second, I feel, for I a second there, I thought he was gonna go Sonic, but that's because I am a Sonic fanboy. Anyways, no words. No <laughs> words. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. No words. I don't think I think should change stage because FD is very stage scary. He's just, yeah, I. <laughs> I, I I don't know anymore. <laughs> I am <laughs> quite. That, that, he, my, my man, Venom thinks he's playing your ninja now. Wrong character, buddy. Wrong character. Hey, shoulder shoulder tackle is pretty fun. All right. It is pretty fun. 
it's like it's like melee ganador and i'm going to continue Ooh. to reference melee ganador forever i respect that melee ganador is everything i still can't i still can't get over how how terry's brother this song is literally just called pasta hey, pasta is delicious Yo, I don't think you need a song for it. Ooh. Ooh. Kind of thing, what? Yeah. Marion doing the hardest tech in the game. Nothing. Hey, sometimes the that's... The thing is, that's doing, not, yeah. doing, doing nothing... Doing nothing in Look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Look at that! She's just standing there, menacingly. I, I think it's... <laughs> I think if Venom Fang did not like absolutely nothing there, like literally just dropped his controller, he would have. Marion would have been more yeah. scared. I think that thing, yeah, I was gonna say, he, not, there's not really much fear. Right because with Terry down till, you can pick up people from ledge. So you mm -hmm. do yeah. down tilt, down tilt, and you burn up. Yeah. I don't know if it hits. I don't know if it hits for ninja ledge. Right? It does. It does. It hits. It does. Well, well, it's on that that it doesn't hit everybody's like, hey, I don't know about that. Like, I don't think I'll hit like Ganondorf's, but that requires testing. Hold up, hold up. Ooh. Ooh, he has to stop. Hold up. Should, should we be dead, Terry? Nope. No. Yeah, oh. No. Oh, we oh, got it. Marion definitely oh. cannot tech anything today. <laughs> I don't think I've. Well, I don't think I've found this before. Yeah, but everybody else is tech against him, so. <laughs> that is what I think. Oh, that should that's be nice. Now it's unfortunate. Just me spacing. Now they're both at kill percent. Oh, Marion He tried. He tried to let him right there. He also missed that. Oh, okay, Marion. He got this. I mean, I got this. Like he's so weird. The things that landing there. Oh, fuck. That wall. Everything is possible. And the possibility. Very struggling to find his kill against Venom Fang. He's pretty comfy right now. This is busted wolf. Up throw, not gonna do it. Oh, missing power, guys. That's, no, that's gonna do it. Terry just over 100. Yeah. About 200%. Like, 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 with the eye. I'm pretty sure there was still, like, missing guy. What's up, ropes? See Ben and look for the double tilt there. Maybe he's listening. Maybe he's listening to us. Maybe be careful what we say. Do you think Ben and watches like just WWE? I feel like sometimes he'll be like, like you know, like he goes for shoulder bashes, burnt knuckles. He likes his moves. He, he, he likes his. Uh, he likes his. Uh, mana. Oh. I just tried to. Can we say? Him. Can we say Ben and just like it's just too intimidating? In the ledge, maybe, maybe that's why yeah, I like the mind game. Terry's arms right. are massive, okay? Yo, I'm back yeah, like, from molding. Welcome I am back. back. <laughs> Welcome back, Gil. Okay, I'm ready to commentate this this set. Terry looks like Zero from Mega Man X, but he was a so man. Rain, Rain fumbled there because uh, he's very he's scared of Terry. I mean, I mean, who wouldn't? I'm, I'm scared of Terry, you okay? We have, have I have nightmares. I have power guys are nightmares. This tournament has okay. The Terry is a member of the IRS. I mean, come on. <laughs> Don't forget that. He's such a member of an IRS. Uh, go go for the Samus area. Leave, leave it yourself. Thinking. Robin, K. Rule, armor him out. Dude, here's for... here's what, I, what I think is a problem with some players um, is that they don't come into a, a set with a game plan, right? Like, you can't be caught off guard and think, what do I do now? You have to come into a set thinking, I'm gonna do this, and if this happens, then I'm gonna play this character, right? Oh, yeah. For sure. I, yes. think, it, I think I should try and do that myself. I don't have a game plan either. I just press charge shot. That's, that's, that's what happened with my set with Yipka. Like, I thought I'm gonna play at least two games of Wolf, and if I lose two, <laughs> what's he doing? He's he's trolling. What oh, sorry, is this? Uh, Jerry, uh, Joe, Joe, continue your thoughts. I want, I want to hear. Congrats, congrats on Venifang winning 3-0. Never mind. <laughs> This is Marion. Yeah, yo, what were you saying about a uh, wolf and clap? Uh, if Marion can take two stocks, I'm giving him 20 bucks. I was, I was saying. right now. Something. Your wife is. Oh my gosh, your wife is getting destroyed right now. Like I said, if he takes 20, if he takes, a, if he takes two stocks, I'm, I'm a e transfer him 20 bucks on the spot. If he takes one stock. I want to see it now. I'm impressed. They're just, <laughs> they're, just, they're just kids, Terry. I'm not I know. 
They're You're kids. not putting money? I nope. put their kids. I think they're kids. I'm pretty short. They're chill. <laughs> what the? Wait, does that mean I'm a kid? Man doesn't know how to get on stage. Hey. <laughs> There's wobble. Oh wait. Oh, Yo, yeah. oh the job oh, log. Oh, this guy's nuts. Oh, look at all oh, the jabs. Oh, this. Oh, it's side. Oh, oh here we go. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah, that, that's ice season. All the time. Just playing like five-year-old plays melee, where you press the side B button with the ice climber. Somehow just win. Does does Mary oh, play melee? Uh, Mary plays a little bit of melee. Yes. Is he play ice season melee? No, no he plays Falco. <laughs> <laughs> the double no. The thing oh, is, Mary definitely oh. has gotten a lot better at melee. Yes. But I don't okay, think he's gonna transfer or use IP. It is definitely I'm not gonna translate. No. Maybe you should have gone Falco then. Oh, this knife is so good. Gosh, the, only this way, the only way Mary gets this 20 bucks is if Venom Fang hears this and literally throws two stocks. Hey. Then if you're money, then I'm gonna the money. Give him a pity 20 cents. That still didn't kill. Terry's so heavy, man. I mean, Terry's heavy the same weight as Samus, so yeah. You, I don't know how he can be the same weight, because he's not wearing super armor, but I digress. I love how Venom Fang is just taking this seriously and isn't just absolutely dicking on me. Venom Fang plays the same part of He's very confident. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, 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 oh my goodness. Not even a stock. Just flat out murder. Oh, no, he was close, he was close, he was close to getting a stock. He, he almost got a stock, yeah. Very, yeah, very, yeah. Look at him in the, in the, in the lucid screen. My man's in shambles. The only one of the like, doesn't even care. Terry doesn't want to see the kids crying. Also, why why is only Pope uh, is Pope the only one in the character screen? What happened to Nana? Did Terry yeah, took died. away Nana's role? Well, Terry said Nana's flying flying Nana. into the afterlife. <laughs> yeah, Nana died. Man died. Oh, Nana's Nana, you dead now? Uh, I did. I'll DM you what happened. Okay, let me, let me check out the bracket. Let me check this a little bit. Uh, so right now. Gonna be Gifka versus Venom, winner uh, for Loser Semis. The winner of that uh, goes against Chucker Joe in Loser's final, and then Grand Finals just waiting there is Grape, aka Peon Man 2. Oh, Grape's gonna be waiting for a while, I think you got two sets to get through here. Gifka Venom thing. One Let's thing go. though is that uh, Chucker Joe is DQ from what I'm looking at. Um, yeah, you're gonna promote winners because of their lag problems with uh, Grape. Yeah. So either they get fixed that, or there's only one more set. But one thing to note is very important is that Venom Fang, and someone please correct me if I'm wrong, is the highest placement jerk student, so he's guaranteed fifty dollars. Oh yes, price. he is. I don't think he's. I don't think he's placed below like top two, three, and I think for weeks he's been just. He just showed up and has just been demolishing everybody. I think. I think Tentacle's beat him a few times, but it. Much of them two going in, but Tentacle got was. Uh, knocked out early today. Yep, I won one one against. Him. Like that's her like head to head. Just to give you an idea, it's pretty good. Did you enter? Uh, no, just, just like last month we entered. Oh, I, last month. Yeah. I, oh, last month, right? Yeah, I won against the own winner and then. I won against. I want to make it to Tantaco in bracket one right. day. So I, feel, I feel like I could beat Tantaco. Yeah, Doug had a very unfortunate yeah. run. Are you saying that like, when Jerky wins now, that you feel like he's also gonna keep win? I'm just kidding. Yeah, he, he was beaten by Legumes actually, by Legumes and Yoshi. Legumes mm -hmm. Yoshi is pretty good. Again, I'm pretty. I, yeah, I'll write it. I think Legumes only lost against Vanguard because he was because Vanguard was just good at like at, uh, at keeping himself Staying alive. Vanguard yeah, just yeah, good. And again, again, <laughs> Terry, Terry is the same way as Samus, and I don't know how that works. That Terry. This no lucky man, the same way as a woman in like a full suit of metal face armor, but whatever. Yeah, he's got I, those muscles. Yeah, he got the muscles. Yeah, yeah. but like, well, like Cloud's got muscles and he's lighter. Cloud's got no muscles. He has muscles. Cloud, Cloud is definitely a twink and. <laughs> Like, yeah, Cloud, Cloud is all roids, okay? Have you guys, like, he's actually, I think it's just canon, right? Like, all, I mean, all of Cloud's weight weird. would come from his sword, because he's, yeah. he's not. Like, okay. he gets far anyway. <laughs> Anyways, 
Oh, oh. oh. give your Wooly one set stock. Each of them did. Each of them works up. Good on him for going for. I think I just find you on the corner right now. Because Terry off stage is trash, so you didn't want to be up with weakness. Then the thing's very good at Wooly stage. I'll be trash at Wooly stage all time. The only thing is that it's gonna be really hard for uh, for Gifka to SDI at the because uh, good old Rob is too big. It's too big. It's dummy big. Dummy big. Yeah, I'm looking pretty even right now. Gifka's strategy is not working out for him as it did as well as it did in Joe's set because Benefang just seems very good. No offense to Joe, of course. Benefang seems a little better getting again. I'm so trash versus Rob. No offense, taking. Now you did well. I think you did pretty well. I thought this, I this personally, our later. I personally uh, thought that if you ooh, were, uh, I, if you stayed, if you stayed, uh, what's it called, uh, close wolf? to him? Oh no, if you stayed wolf, I think he would have, you would have definitely done a little bit of a better job with that. I, I just see that. No, that the eye like cloudy work. But either way, we're we're talking about kind of thing now. And that's kind of do it. Yeah, Rob is a chunky boy. Uh, there you go, that's it. Chunky it robot. Venefang moves so fast. Like, you just watch it, and I can hardly keep up with it. He just dances back and forth. Ooh. It definitely hits the training mode. I'm saying move too much, I'm sorry. Venefang knows his combos, knows his character very well. For sure. And good delay on the, on like the, that. On the map there. Oh, almost hit him. I don't know if these two have played before. I know oh, I'm familiar with Benefang. Oh, 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 he, he knows what he's doing. So why are you oh, he knows. Up there? Yeah, now he has both of us. Oh, wait, hold up. I, I do think if you ask him, Gifka needs to get better at like left down or something. Yeah, Gifka, I think it's just. Oh, oh. unfortunate. Gifka should have Jarrah on stage more because Benefang is kind of just running at him. Yeah, Gifka trying to get away, and Benefang's kind of following him, and then you never know once, once Terry gets there, there's so much damage. Get it in. Okay, okay, I see you, Venefang. I see you, Parry. Oh! There's a down there. Like you said yep. before, you want to bear it down there, you got bear down there. After the throw, he went for a fair, and Venefang always went low, so that's how he just went for a spike instead. Mm -hmm. Ace is and Terry's know that they go low, they risk things quite like that. Yeah, I mean, that's a risk. That's why... Risk reward. Yeah. I don't... Did he do input out? I don't know, did he, did he do the input version of Rising Tackle? I didn't quite doesn't do Doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Doesn't matter against that counter, against that spike, doesn't matter. No, I guess not. You're going, you're going to the pits of hell regardless. <laughs> Imagine going to heaven and then Rob said, downer. Downer. <laughs> Straight down. You're not allowed. Because Venomfang controlled that match pretty well up until the end, but Gifka just kind of reversed it on him. Uh, I think the problem there was like the thing is he has did well. He had the percentage. He well, he had to go. Like you know, he could have pulled out a bit more damage, and the Gifka will be a bit more scared to just go in. I like this big of some, uh, mm. Yeah, this is a good space for Terry. Like... He's such a small space orb, but Terry needs to be in CQC a lot. What did what did Gifka ban? What do you guys think he banned? Joshi's? Probably Triplast fight, I guess. Yeah, Joshi's on. Okay, upper. Yep, up B, that's gonna do a true combo on, on Rob. It's too easy to combo this character. He's always delaying his up. Alright, nice. Just good old jab, jab, jab. Power talk. Anything you notice uh, in this game, Tyler, it's different from the other ones? I'm not gonna lie. Uh, no, <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I don't really notice anything different. I mean, oh, yeah, honestly, I, 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 I think it could be a little more aggressive. I'm literally just saying the same thing as well. I, I, I've just, I've been watching very, I've been very quiet, very quiet, just trying to figure out. Hard to, so, what, many guys, so many guys talking. What I can specifically say that is different than what I was saying before. But I feel like I feel like I'd be repeating myself with a little bit of deja vu. Because all I know is Gift is playing exactly like how he played against Joe. And Venom Fang is just just doing stuff. He's doing Terry yeah. stuff. 
I don't first game like that last. I see. I see. I feel like it's approaching a little more. Like he seems to be already know that Van Fang's not gonna fall for the cat and mouse play, as we called it. Oh, I don't like that grab there. That was a little scary. That was yeah. too scary. Yeah. Oh, that's good that's easy a little late. Ooh, that was a good cross up. It's hard to cross up. Robbie's very thick. Please take a shot every time one of us say thick. Because we're going to say that a lot. Thick. <laughs> okay, we want to... I don't, don't, don't want to kill somebody tonight, okay? Oh. Oh. There's already been a lot of people yeah. on the screen. <laughs> I will not do that anymore. Alright. There's Gifka's on the last line. Venipan looking very healthy right now. Rob, Rob also could get him for one of the best recoveries. You can just fly... Yeah. All he can stall. Alright, he can stall. Yeah, you can stall, and then... And the, the upgrade makes it possible to challenge he, he, he has a fuel right. limit, but it's so generous. And it, he he yeah. It's the distance by pumping it, right? Uh, yeah. So, yeah, it, just, it makes you go higher and so save So you, like, you uh, conserve it, pretty much. Yeah. You can also hit people as they come to you as well. Oh? Oh. I actually, uh, okay. he actually could have yeah, yeah, nice. I, he actually could have dropped, their, uh, dropped down in back here. Just to give you an idea. It's a move that a lot of people don't use with Terry, which is actually pretty good if you ask me. Terry's back here. Yo, did you oh, know that Terry back here stage spikes? Yes. <laughs> I, I understood that reference. <laughs> Alright, so it's now 1 1 for uh, between Gifka and Vanupheim. It is a best yeah. of five. So these two competitors they still need to win uh, two more each. At, le at least, you know, the first one to win two more. I think I'm gonna have my dinner and just keep watching without mic off, so you guys can talk over talk for a while. Oh boy. <laughs> Wait, did I see? Did I see? What, okay. What's going on here? Nothing in there. Are we kidding? Oh, okay. No, okay. What? Okay, 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 okay. What? what? Uh, hello? 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 <laughs> fine? Yo. How are we going to get to see game Nintendo? 3? Classic Nintendo. Oh, oh, oh okay. there we go. Oh, okay, someone oh, fixed oh. it. Alright, he was a funny guy. He was the one doing it. Alright. Speak I, up. I actually Let's have go. never seen that before. What was going on? Alright, so we're going back to the uh, uh, platform to play around with. Mm, I don't know. I don't know if I like this for for Venom Fang. It's, I mean, it's, it has to be, it has to deal with the fact that like, you know, he probably banned the other two FDs in the game, right? Like Talon and, and Kalos, right? I think he just kept it to someone, I assume. Could be, we can, I can check. No, I don't think I can check anymore. Wow. I was gonna say, I can check his bands on Smash EU, but I can. Anyway, I don't know about this pick on FD. It's gonna be kind of tough for yeah, it's gonna be kind of tough for Phantom Frank to land, just as I said that yep. he gets up smash. Yeah, I but, don't like the fact you have other platforms for Cicero. I personally yeah. don't. Because you're kind of gonna want him to land on platforms first and then cover his landing there. He makes it a lot more mm -hmm. easy because you don't have to shield when he comes down on you. Especially with those yep. nares. Those are extremely safe, long range. They kind of do everything. Well, I mean, the one thing is that it's. I think if you're if you're fairly good at parrying, it's actually one of the easiest moves to parry in the game. I haven't learned that because Rob does this little like speed move animation. Nice, gotcha. Yeah. Yeah, Venipan is really good at anti and Rob here. Yeah. But yeah, but we want, I'm gonna have to disagree with you there because there. parrying is only one aspect of of the, the gameplay here. It's like, if you parry and thinks you're gonna go for parry, that means that opens up empty pop into anything you want. Yep. And so there's a lot more to just parry and win. I, I yeah. Clock, um, that's why I yeah. think that Robbie's like top five. I don't know. No, not top five, top 10. At least top 10, yeah. Yeah, it is crazy. Uh, it's it's so many like, mix-ups. The depth to his gameplay is just crazy. Yeah, but Ooh, uh, exploded. Uh, exploded. Uh, but yeah, but the, the one thing that's like when it comes to, when it comes to like landing. Oh yeah, that's kind of good. Uh, when it comes to like landing, right? It's like be careful to 
like especially when you have no platforms, right? Like I think I do think you when you do carry on point. Oh no! Oh. He died at 29. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Well, if you went for that backer stage spike, I had no idea what was going on that entire time. <laughs> it well, it's like yeah, there maybe... was. There was there was an attempt at neutral, <laughs> for maybe, sure. Maybe Venefang heard us say that carry backer stage spikes and he went for it, and then he died at 29. Why didn't he throw the match? Why didn't he throw that one match for Marion to get twenty dollars? <laughs> <laughs> Did someone yeah. say that in the chat? Oh, I yeah. said yeah. yeah. I think uh, so. Wait, twenty bucks. Fox Master, Fox Master 6900 said you could have made oh, twenty yeah. bucks. I love Fox Ma Fox Master Nine Double Zero. All right, on to game four. Gifka could easily take this as long as he just hovers outside of the the thing that he's been doing. Just as long as he keeps doing the thing that he's been doing. I really think Crack should more. Yeah, Crack should more in this matchup for sure. Just just get just get in the face of Rub. Just be like, hey, I'm I'm here now. It's just like an immediately high. It's I'm very here hard now. to now get there. The thing is, Rob. even even if you somehow get into Rob's range, Rob has the tools to just be like, like "Well, no, fuck, I'm gonna get you out of my face." And yeah. you're done. Yeah. Ooh, okay. A lot of kills on the top here. I wonder if FD's low ceiling has anything to do with it with this counter pick. Or was Benefang not banning it? He's gonna eat those backers. Gifka's backers are alleged have been making him a lot of money this, this tournament. Very great speed. Wow. This is so good. Jeff's kiss. Uh, yeah, like, I really like the use of support. Just like, you know, just crack shoot. Oh, okay. A bit too really. Like no risk of going for it, not like Terry can challenge you when you, when you go yeah, low. True. But I think if Benefang is, a, is able to take like the stuck. Oh my gosh, oh the Zidara? The geometry on the lasers. <laughs> oh no, that was a little greedy up here. That, that, that was an Ume Shoryu if I've ever seen. Don't roll. Gifka has to lead hold up. This this is like falling apart. Checking. Did he throw with the gyro? Don't throw with the gyro. Oh, 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 oh. No. Gets yeeted. Something to keep in mind is that Gifka oh, is also very good. Right? He's also planning to get to get paid. Like he's not getting any money if he just gets it. There's a semi You're right. Yeah. A man wants to eat in McDonald's afterwards. You know, he wants some, some of those McDonald's fries. He wants to definitely treat himself. Exactly. Oh my oh, god. Nice. That, that nice scene. He, ju he just ran away. He literally just ran away with no attempt to jump over the, the power geyser. That one was like, a power or, no, no, no. There, he threw. Sorry, uh, not a power geyser. Uh, he threw out a power wave, and uh, Gifka literally just ran. <laughs> and he turned around and hit it with a gyro to cancel it. That is the most. That, that's just Rob play. Is that it? Oh, nice oh, up to Oh my God, we are going oh, to get kills and come up top. And again, and I don't know what I'm going to say during this. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. I don't know how to commentate this. It's so weird. <laughs> They're playing at such an odd pace. It's like, uh, it's good gameplay. I'm just a bad commentator. <laughs> or bad gameplay, good commentator. It's never commentator's fault. It's always the player's fault, right? It's always like that. You're right. That's how, that's They're just bad. Right. <laughs> I can't even say that. Three, two, one, go. All right, and now we have uh, again. Uh, this is gonna be game five for losers to just to get into losers final. And the thing is that Joker Joe did get left test and he lost it. So, <laughs> so this is this probably grand finals as well. No, no, this is not. This is not. He is going. Well, we're gonna see how it goes with whoever he has to play next. Yeah, exactly. And then we're gonna go. So, so, what happens with the lag test thing? Um, 
If they get the grands, then they're not gonna play it out. If Choco Joe and the Grape get the grands. I'll, I'll clean it after the set. Alright. After. <laughs> he saved his jump though, he bought it back. Oh my god, he made it back. You know, it's, it's crazy because, like, it's like Venom Punk gets so many kills off the top, but also Yifka gets so many kills just off, like, just backers. Like, they both have, like, the one move they always seem to, like, land the opponent. Except Venom Punk this time said, no, I'm not, you're not lame, you have, like, landing on me for. Okay, okay, Gifka. Do you see that? He did double touch into down smash. The man does not care anymore. Beef could definitely using Wi-Fi to his advantage, and he should because he's playing Rob. That's just yeah, Wi-Fi Robs. Yeah. Yeah. No, nope. Benefit got good DI on that on the up air. It only kills early when you cross up with DI. Oh, hello. This game's trash. I think Venipa has quite a good armor. Hold up. Oh. Bang the hero. Dead, Dead robot. A blood armor on this guy. Hold up. <laughs> Venipa knows what he's going for. There's the jab, jab, power, dunk. The classic. This is tough to get in. Look at. He just puts up a wall there. You can't even shoot projectiles past it. You can't jump over it. You, you can't, but you're gonna oh. get hit. Ooh. Ooh. All right. Okay, I'm better fang in the game. He, he it just takes one down tilt. He's looking for it. He's looking for a down tilt up tilt. Oh, Oster Wolf? That was across the stage, though. No kill. Ooh. Oh, the back just came after the round. I'm on that one. Yeah. I feel like Benefang is, is putting himself in the guessing game and not a reaction game. And that's why he got back right there. Just a but raw, that was just a raw area of buff. Jesus. I guess correctly there though. Like my man looking like he should be playing like 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 new uh fine look like gambling, you know, he should be too gambling, he should be like in force racing out here. It is definitely just yeah. Yeah, these these power geysers just hoping he's gonna jump into them or Okay, oh, okay, oh. so Gifka keeps doing the thing. Gifka What's keeps trying to pull out Gifka keeps trying to pull out Gyro when he doesn't have Gyro. Is that oh, just like, is that, that just a Rob thing Blew for them up. to basically taunt? No. So is he just a better thing though? Down. Winning game five. Yep. So is he literally just mashing down B, hoping he can get another Gyro, or what? What is that for? I don't. I don't think so. Yeah, he's just trying to get another Gyro out so he can grab it. It's crazy. Because as, as soon as Gyro re despawns, then you can grab another one, and it despawns on. Shields, or in a blast zone, or after it's time, like as you can see. Yep, that's why when you have gyro, and you, if you happen to be a person who does not know how to like combo with gyro, because I think I, I was recommend against Rob, you need to get good at combo with gyro, like as your character, because it's yeah. so, because Rob is combo food and, and giving you an item, just like free percentage or like free kill. But if you don't know how to use gyro, what you want to do is you want, you want, you want to throw it out in here. And just leave it there as long as possible so you can yeah. You want to throw it right up in the air, and that way it just takes as long as it can to come down, and yep. Rob doesn't have access to it the entire time. Yep. But honestly, Venom Fang, you know... Okay, but also congrats to Gifcon making fourth place at this tournament. Pretty stacked tournament, so he did good. Had some good wins. Right. Well, I want to say special thanks to York University Student Center before we continue. They have sponsored our last journeys and they keep sponsoring and keep helping us organize all these monthlies. So, a huge thanks to them. Yes. They Their description is in the, the link below and you can see their Instagram right here. They also have Twitter. They've been recently active on that. So, go and follow them there, especially if you're a York student. They've been really good to us. So, we want to thank them again. They also have some contests running on their Instagram page that you should go check out. Definitely give them a follow for, well, mainly York students. Yep. Uh, All right, back to the tournament. tournament. Campus opens up again. You want to, you want to definitely visit the student center at York. It is amazing.
All right, production here while we wait. Uh, what's your favorite food to get at York Student Center? Not Wendy. just. Wendy's free. The underground has got some good the tater tots. Yeah, good tater tots. I've never had them. Like All right, what, do you guys want to tell us about this, this match coming up? Sure, so we got Monkey versus... versus Bigger Monkey. 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 <laughs> Realistically, it's just Bigger Monkey. monkey. <laughs> it's a blonde Italian monkey, that's big. Yeah, American man. Is Terry Italian? I, I, yeah. I, I don't know, his brother Andy Bogart, his brother song is... Hard. His song Andy is Bogart, so you can over it. Yeah. But I'm pretty sure Terry Bogart, I think he's a, he's a, he's married. He yeah, he's married. Yeah, definitely is married. Well, SNK's version of America. But, uh, is it, wait, is this like us? I'm just, is this laggy? Or is this free laggy? Uh, it's true. Is, is this a like us? Okay, no, it's laggy. It looks a little choppy to me. But... Oh, the banana F smash is gonna be Ooh, the DI surviving. Taking a lot of stocks. I just think that if okay, if Chogojo knew that that F smash wasn't gonna kill, he should have went for down smash to go get an edge guard opportunity. Because again, that's where Harry struggles the most off stage. Very good up smash. Diddy has the fastest up smash in the game, rank five. Really good out of shield and really long range. Only in front of him, though. Yep, he does not pick up behind him, and his people can fall out of it. Sometimes it's kind of rare. Honestly, the one thing I was said about Didi as a character is that it's it can be kind of hard to for Didi to come back when like Didi's like behind, especially like stuck. But when it's the other way around, like Didi is the one ahead, when Didi you know can control more like the pace of the match, that's when Didi ultimately excels. No, I completely agree because Didi he has the tools to keep you out, but he doesn't have the tools to get in, and that's exactly yep. how you make comebacks. You have to get in, and it's also why he stops people from making comebacks because he stops them from getting in. So. That's just in his character design. But also what I really like about Diddy is that he has a very slow burn in his kills. So you see Venom playing at 150 here. It's gonna be a standard thing in a set. Because uh Oh different F tilt. Punch. Because Terry's very light and Diddy doesn't kill very early. 100 percent agree. Oh okay, yeah, okay, cool. I mean that's the one okay. two he has to take now. Honestly, this this is this is definitely like an uphill battle. But hey, if I see anyone make comebacks in this tournament, it has me benefit. Yeah, you're right. Especially with especially, Go. Especially after that. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, so yeah. it is a like... little bit of lag. This is what Choco Joe out of Winter's Finals, but it's Choco Joe's stand. <laughs> But Venafang told me enough to play down and played out some slideshows versus me, so I think he'll <laughs> he won't even lag test. So here we go, now we're gonna see Yeah. Oh, so that's no no reason definitely. to get out of shield. Oh the 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 lag definitely did help him DI there. <laughs> I don't think it matters. I think this, this game is yeah, it's probably the game. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's it. That was and a very Shoko good setup. Joe really game. want to, to go to Grand? Smaller man's out to play. Definitely did win that. All right, I am back. I see Choco Joe and Benefag are playing losers finals. Yes. I heard. I heard it's a bit laggy. A little bit, just towards the end there. But I believe we're gonna play out. I don't know if you've seen this matchup before, Diddy and Terry. Is that how Choco Joe? I highly doubt it. You have seen it before. I have seen it. I highly doubt I've it. Played it. Like before, I I ain't seen Terry versus Yoshi either. It is different characters coming out tonight than usual. I love how half the players here are Terry players. 
I know. I told you, just Ontario was full of Terry's, Donkey Kong, snakes, fringes, and Pokemon trainers. And everyone has everyone has a pocket Joker also. Joker, Joker, you get that funny fair one, and that's, that's all you need to get a stuff. That man, funny. Good to land that man. Yeah, they're not even talking about a lag test. I don't think they're even. Gonna, they're not worried about it. These players both familiar with Wi-Fi. <laughs> I'm pretty sure both these players are, are, are more used to like worse conditions and so good. You kind of just gotta expect it at this point. I mean, like if you're yeah. playing in online tournaments, then you kind of just gotta do it. Pretty much. <clears throat> I mean, I'm sure they've eaten at least. Okay. The thing. Okay. In order to do power dunk the other way, that's kind of hard to miss input. Like I can understand like you know, burn off or like crack shoot, but like those ones are kind of hard to miss input. Now they were like, in, in, although if you ask me personally, the like it, it is, I think the more it benefits than the time though. Because his combos are a bit more easier. Like, I don't know. Guaranteed. I'm more guaranteed, which helps a lot. He just walked into that one. I think he was trying to SDI. As soon as he gets by jab, he's going to want to like, wiggle his around, and, and he was probably wiggling in that direction. Look like it. Now, oh wait, no back here. He's in the back here. We got some good pressure, just barely out of range though. All oh, that up smash oh. we talked about doesn't hit from the back. No, he should. He should go for smash. I don't want to see. I want to see going for smash really. Yep, there you go. <laughs> there there you go. <laughs> that up air probably wouldn't even kill. Diddy's up air is very weak. Yeah, it's not smash 4. Yeah, it's not like 8 frames. It's, it's gonna be his best option to cover air dodge. Air dodge for that difference. Dunks? Double dip? Oh, wait, double dunk? Oh, yes. Even turn around. Disgusting, the double dip. Ah, sure, because you're definitely the banana grab. That's not a banana, that's a banana. Oh my goodness. Oh, shit. That would have been amazing. Oh, he was so close. That was going to be some YouTube. He's going for it again. He's going for it. He's definitely going for it again. He's going to fail in the fails compilation. Oh my goodness. That's a stock. Movement is all in Chokujo's favor right now. Right. I'm under the. He really, I, wants, I'm, he really wants that there. Guys, this is why you yeah. not double double dip. It's my head cannon that uh that jungle beat. Oh, the... oh. <laughs> my head cannon. Are you implying he's playing with the bongos? Oh, the jungle, you know the jungle bongos. Jungle so bang. Nasty. He's playing with the bongos. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. Just just shut up. Every time I say something like that, it just immediately happens right after. And what is the score now? One, one, one. One, one. one, one. Production should be updated soon. Go I want to say I don't know. I production don't know who doing everything at once. I don't know who is protecting Venom Fan right now. What kind of like outer entity is just protecting Venom Fan right now? But they're doing a really good job at it because that was good blood it's armor. Called, right? Is there a good blood armor? Say, Venom Fan saying if, if you said if I'm gonna be on Yeet Smash, I'm gonna be the one doing the combos. <laughs> That's what he said. Oh, no. Chokujo was riding that movement so well up until the end there, and we got took 60% from a single combo and then died at like 80 the next two hits. Yeah, that, that, that sounds like Terry in a nutshell. Yeah, just. You don't kill him fast, and he comes back just super dangerous. Like a wounded animal, the most dangerous. Here we go. Diddy has the fruit basket on the side, playing with bananas and peanuts. He has the anime. The whole, the whole fruit basket, the pineapple, <laughs> the banana peels. Look, the apples. Why don't I grab him? And he only locks in the three bears. Oh, oh he went for an outer. Oh, he really went for the bears tonight. <laughs> that was a very tweaked down there to go for. Can you get out of the jump over there? You're gonna run because power dunk oh. auto cancels on the ground, right? What does? A uh, power dunk doesn't auto cancel. Is that why no, Terry it just has very little lag? Oh, very little lag. Yeah. I know his lane lag if he lands on a platform. Which I'm fine. Terry's worst saving for you here. 
but that's not that's not legal here. No, I think I think it just has very little light. Not blue with light, light on. I like these these dunks he's going for, but I want to see them off a Z drop instead of just a banana pain. It's gonna give yeah, me more control of when the banana falls. I think that's percent this percent now when Terry has less legend ball, but you definitely go for a Z drop. You definitely gotta have more control of your banana. Yeah, yeah. I think that's one thing that definitely yep. about. I was gonna say he monkey flip. He does monkey flip. I'm, I... Oh, he's I just have, running around the flats. Hey, whoa, you cannot just leave your banana over there. Yeah, Terry can I just grab it. Come on, man. Probably, probably not Terry lurk, lurk with the banana. Okay, oh, that's that that down tilt. Just down tilt is a guarantee of smash by Diddy on shield. Down there, another one. He's gonna go for his combo. Nope. No. It's a good attempt though. I think it went for the four to the four. Yeah, he knows good. it. He's got it multiple times. Uh, Choco right. Joe could probably just run away for the rest of the game because oh. Terry had Terry would have no way of getting Go Sauce. But he, and but he, he could probably. He could definitely run away for six minutes if he wanted to. I think it's like he. I mean, he has to endure six minutes of this too, not just kind of fact. Yeah. That was that's the follow up. He just ran right into him. Yeah, he, he should maybe really Z dropping the banana more. Like there, he just threw it. And nice down tilt. Oh, look at that di. Ooh, he's moving. Oh, crash oh. landing. Oh. That's a that's a Pepe hands moment right there. I think he, he wanted to get the explosion. He wanted to get the explosion there, but he didn't, definitely did not want to, to die off that. Nobody wants to die. One will say. Big yourself. Oh, well, that was. Okay, that was a guaranteed back here, though. Once, you, once down to the person in the tumble, it's a guaranteed back here. He's doing pretty good at beating Curry stuff. There you go, now he knows. Took 60, created 12%. It's worth it. 60 or 28, Okay, Venifang, he was put in this position before, being one stock down two, and uh, he came out on top. Yeah, but he stole that though. He's not happy. Oh, that was a good idea. Nice down there. There's load him. Just like you said, you just need to go. Benefit can very well steal this. Yeah, he's just like a few. Oh, he caught the way. Oh, that up there is super weak. Oh, dear. Nice. Spirit's not gonna connect. Oh, down to there, here you go. Oh, this is scary, this is scary. He's scared, he's scared. He's scared Buster Wolf, I'm sure. Or Power Geyser. Do it. Uh, I think he's gonna do it again. He's full rage, yeah. Did he, did he die as if one, he oh. one of the commercials? Yeah, Choco just scared for his life. I would be too, man. Oh, that's not it yet. Not a, not a ledge yet. Are you okay? Oh, he must take a punish there. What is that? <laughs> Actually, definitely watching. Oh, it's in the middle of the match. Oh, this is. This is. This is so scary. I I like they, both, they both might as well be above 200. <laughs> We're gonna get the sudden death. He could time out. Oh, he doesn't want to get hit by any monkey flips. No bananas. Oh no. Sam too far. He's too high. Oh no! Two hundred and twenty percent. That's a Samus percent. Right? I'm seeing oh. it. There's an our entity out here. Mango is watching from the <laughs> heaven. Frankly, Mango is doing whatever to him. That's gotta also, be very what? disheartening for Cho Cho yeah. to be up two stocks to one, two games in a row, and then lose it to go. You can feel the nerves. But I, I, but I do think he was a little too scared of the... So like he was dancing around. Yeah, yeah. He, 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 wasn't, he wasn't putting on the pressure right. enough. He was, he was getting himself cornered yeah. and losing his options when he does that. He got too nervous. Yeah. You gotta have confidence when, when you want to take a stock. Yeah, Venipank ran into that and was able to get it out, clutch it out. Back to PS2. Yeah. Back to PS2. Okay. Venipank went away from the wheel. 
grand finals. Was great. Oh, mess up. Right. I, get. I, I feel like when it comes to just poking, I think Chuckers are just one. Like every time, just the start of a match. And you know, they're just start poking each other, just playing a bit of neutral. I think Choker just always win on that. It's just when it comes to, I suppose, after the neutral, you know, after the like, like engagement. I just said, yeah, that's where like Benefang has been able to always get out of a well, not always, but like most times get out of Choker. Well, nice good catch, catch, good catch. You wonder, Benefang not afraid to do that up to catch someone in the anti air. Even though it's so committed. Like, once you miss that, you just fall to the ground, all vulnerable, all in lag. Yeah. Well, he doesn't like as much landing lag, though. Like, oh. You're free fall. Put into, yeah, yeah, yeah. Put into free fall. Yeah. At least, at least some moves you don't, you don't have, like, some trouble. Like, I know Sonic Spring Jump, you'll get put in, like, special leg, but that's not free fall. Never mind. Just disregard me. More you know. Okay, so the reason why Banana is going to be so powerful here is because it's transcendent. So that means any hitbox that tries to challenge Banana, Banana is going to just go through it. And yeah, like it. a multi leader does that, right? Yes. Well, the only only or... yeah. the only I thought time that like, cancels out yeah. is when it meets another Banana hitbox. Is very confident right now. I think Joker Dose here has got him a little bit last game. Yeah, this is like. Benefang was scary when he's behind, but now he has a lead. And he has go. So this and is like, Yeah, that is a snowball mechanic. Case in point, I think, I think he tries a banana to be funny. This is looking very scary for a yeah, very rough. But twice now, Chocobo, like you said before, twice now Chocobo had a huge lead and he blew it. And I think it's <laughs> very demotivating. And again, yeah, it's just definitely die. tough. I I know, it's, gonna be, it's gonna pump up Benefang too. Never mind. Being down and just taking those those two games in a row. Yeah, yeah. Choco 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 Joe's not Choco Johnny. You said it's not student, right? No. I don't. Oh, I don't know. Sort of down air. I, I don't like that down air, but I respect it. I respect it too. Is it is it basically the same as that? Yeah. Oh, nice. Parry. I get the good pun on top of it though. Did he so small the banana just went right over his head? Oh, that's yeah, that's gonna kill that's him at ledge. Congrats to Venafang making it to grand finals. Once again, okay. this guy's been making it so far in every tournament that we have. I believe third place at the first one. Yeah, he then, just got out of nowhere. Yeah, third, second, and right now he's guaranteed top two. Oh, did a great job oh. today, too. Very stacked here. Oh, no, no. We'll just finals. Third and third. Yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. Always making top three. Most consistent. He has been putting in work with that, Terry. All right, so for grand finals, I am definitely going to be hopping off. I'm going to leave the commentary to these three amazing gentlemen who actually understand the <laughs> Four amazing gentlemen, uh, including production. Uh, I am going to be hopping off. You'd like to right. shell out. Thank you for commentating with us. Yeah, I will. I will. Uh, I'm going to be streaming also, uh, just a little bit after this. So, you can find me at Six Tails, S I X T A L E Z, basically everywhere Instagram, Twitter, sixtails.ca. There's nothing there, but you know what? You can check it out anyway. <laughs> All right. <laughs> There's nothing there, but. There's stuff there. Own. Nothing there. But if you're a homie, hit that follow button. If you're a homie, definitely hit that follow button. Follow the stream. Check in soon. I will definitely, definitely follow the stream. Definitely be going live soon. Awesome. A lot than, may pe than you may think. Well, thanks for coming by. Thank you for having me. It's always been a pleasure. All right, have so, a great night. All right. Good night, everybody. Enjoy the rest of the tournament. Thank you. All right. I'm glad Venafang for making it to experience. And I'm also glad for the tournament that we get to see a Grand Finals. Because if, if Grape and Chokojo went to Grand Finals, they weren't going to play it out. As they were lagging in Winner's Finals. And that's what put, yeah. what put Chokojo in Loser's Finals. The tournament, that, did, is it, was it Chokojo the one lagging against him? Yeah. But he oh, did okay. make top three, though. Yeah, he made top yeah, three. He did excellent. Did. Now for Peon Man, too. Grape's on his way.
It's been an interesting night. Yeah. Hope we can do this again. Is this, this is a monthly, like we're doing this again in March? Yes, we will. Okay, I can try and commentate again. Com commentate again. For sure. I'm gonna try no, and I'll perform what I did this time. I don't know if I'm gonna enter next time. <laughs> oh, that point I was making about Rob, like way before. I do want to mm -hmm. finish that thought. So, when I was facing Gifka, I was thinking um, I'm gonna play at least two games with Wolf, and then if that doesn't work, I'm gonna stick, like, do a third game counter pick. And I was like, Cloud because Big Sword. And I was doing good. I felt comfortable at first, and I felt like this is the right choice. But I just made a few errors there that were just Rob knowledge things. Yeah, just kill your. Killed your momentum. Have you, have you grinded the matchup with other people? I have not. And I, partially because I hate Rob and I don't want to even play him. Oh but, yeah, like me. I don't want to play Terry, but I'm actually, I got to join like Terry Core and just like ask somebody, hey, come kick my butt so I can learn some things. Exactly. That's that's probably what I should be doing. Yeah, but, I'm in so many character cores. I don't, I don't really visit them. I only, I only go to like Samus Cord, Byleth Cord, um, sometimes Ridley Core, Sonic Cord, which is crazy. Yeah. Samus Cord just chilled off. Resource, I love Samus to find opponents to play. There's a whole display oh, sure. full, of, full of mains of that character. I have so many pinks on that I go get yeah, rid of. I, I recommend to anyone watching that if you want to get better, they, you always need to look at it. Okay, do I struggle against like they get a specific playstyle? Do I struggle? Like you, you definitely want to take a look at your videos or your bots of like how you're playing and see specifically what you're struggling against. Well, because sometimes it's the easy is just grinding the matchup. Right, mm -hmm. it's like okay, I just don't know how to do against, don't know what to do against this character, right? So you just go to the character court and just grind the matchups. They have decent players. Some of them might not be the best, but they do have a lot of really good players uh, in those courts. So, so yeah. Um, another thing is if it's a playstyle thing, you know, then then you can then that's where you can just brainstorm, you know, right? Like it's sure. there's, I think there's always the thing. The great thing about online though is that you know, as just to put a little bit of positivity to it is like. There's always gonna be a way for you to get better. Like there's always gonna be so hours like resources out there, right? People willing to help you. Yeah, and you can you can connect with so many people. Just yeah. If you presses a few buttons. Yep. Completely so, agree. I think yeah, that's really the beauty of Elite Smash, and I know that people like to bash on Elite Smash and the players and the net code and everything about it, but just being able to hit up the the game, right, press like a few buttons, and start up a match. It's just been so helpful to, to me. I, I want to talk more about this, but we have grand, grand finals to get to right now. So we have yes. Grapes uh, Roy coming out first, versus, of course, Venom Bank, who's in here for a lot tonight. Yep. Turn on PS2, I'm guessing. Two, yep. One, so this is going to be the first time seeing Keon Man 2. This is great. This is great. Smurf. Yeah, the Smurf great. Are we, are we doing a live test? Uh, I don't think so. No. We're gonna find out what's benefiting. Maybe right there. Here. No, it's not. Okay. Okay, yeah, we're, we're playing it out. No, I, I should watch this. That's a great pattern for way like flying before. Did you back in front of him? <laughs> he, was, he was SDI. He was SDI. I, I know he was trying to do SDI, but he, he accidentally threw from a tea bag. Imagine being so good at the game that you accidentally threw from a tea bag. That's yeah, how he, that buddy is. So, BM, you're getting comboed, and out of your combo, you just tea bag. Very funny. <laughs> it's part of the mental game, it's a strategy. Yeah. That is interesting because <laughs> now Terry has, just, Terry has the Dark Discord to get around. And the character that can keep up with him. No, both of these characters are basically brawlers. Roy, yeah. his sword is a noodle. So what he's actually doing is he's punching you and he's holding a noodle sword. That's why the, the strong hit is close oh to the sword. Yeah, Cypher's got to it. Back to Terry? Oh, back to yep. Wow. Cybia Ledge is extremely strong. Oh. That was really Plank. No, Terry, you can't plank with a sword. Sorry. All right. One thing. One thing I'm pretty sure that Peter Man has also noticed is that uh, out of jabs, uh, Venom Tank likes to air dodge in, and you never want to like make it like obvious that you're air dodging in a lot of yeah. times because what they're gonna do is like they're gonna go jab, dash and back, then, and forward. Punch. Yeah, and then you're gonna eat an even bigger punish. Yep. And it's what I noticed a lot of top players do, is when they're getting comboed, they just do nothing. And wait for their little opening to get out of the combo. Yeah. Because if you're buffering an option and they start reading the options that you're buffering, then 
Dude, this is gonna get hit by even harder stuff. Break now, is gonna make mint feel. He's too hard. I almost said Tan Taco. <laughs> Tan Taco. Sorry, I, I, only, I only got her for oh. Has Grape Very good reaction. Roy before? Is, is he new to Roy? Is he playing? No, is he, a second? He's a Snake Roy Comey. Oh, okay. I, I, I know he's Roy. I like Tan Snake. He's, he's been Snake for a long time. I think he picked up Roy sometime in quarantine. Oh, okay. Yeah, I find a lot, a lot of like zoners have like a story secondary. Like a lot of Samus players. Samus players have a Lucina secondary. Believe me. Yes. Yeah, Venom Fang is struggling very hard right now. <laughs> That's gonna do it. Yeah, I believe. I, should, I, should I, just did, I just I can't, I can't talk in commentary. I'm just gonna curse everybody if I say something. <laughs> good on you good on you for recognizing that when he pressures downers at ledge, then Venom Fang is gonna be afraid and try and tech. And so he got that panic option there and went to cover the roll. Mm -hmm. And that was actually the second time that he covered roll and killed Venom Fang for it. The first time yep. being a back air, this time with F tilt. Now Roy I'm wondering. Is... Oh, sorry. Okay, Royal Ledge is very scary, and so it makes sense why Venifang is going to want to roll. But sometimes you need to put yourself in the scary situation because if they think that you're scared, like if they know that you're scared and they smell that, then they're going to start covering roll. And that's going to get even worse. Like we were talking about, like, I don't just want to take the hit and take the, the bad positioning being in the corner instead of, like, rolling and eating something worse. Mm hmm, yep. You don't want you, you, you don't want them to smell you. That, that's that's a really good way to explain it. It's like good players they will just smell you. Very insightful. They'll smell the fear. I was, I was going to ask him about whether he might see his uh, grape snake at all, but I don't think with that three star. I don't think. Well, not sure we're going to because like his Ben Defense kind of losers. So yeah, if Grape wins the board, that's it. Yeah, I think I think he wanted to go roar the entire tournament, but when he was put in a position where he's afraid of losing, then he just switched the snake. Yeah, but I was talking about like just the set right now. If we'll see the snake at all. Yeah, I don't think so. If the set keeps going like it is for game one, or if he did for game one. The Roy he went, he not, he he went snake snake. first gamer because gamer's DK is too good, so he actually has to go <laughs> snake there. Yeah, he also his knee. Usually counterfix the smash goal, I noticed. I think because I think it's Terry's best state. I'm not just, sure. You're just he's, you're forced to be so so close to him. It makes sense. I think it's Joshi suggestion. Is either this or FD? It probably depends on the mind. It depends on the mind. I see I just know. I see Benefit come here when he loses a match. Okay, well, well, yeah. Already Benefit taking more stocks than in the first game. Yo, one purpose? You take those? Uh, yeah, I'm really great yeah, back. I do. Take back, take the back there. That's the only stock you're ever gonna take from me in the set. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, something I do want to notice or note is that Roy on ledge, like okay, when you're on ledge versus Roy, there's not much Roy can do. Like the scariest thing you can hit you with is a little weak down tilt. Yeah, and well, it's gonna poke you and you can jab grab ledge. ledge but... Well, I actually jab. jab can... does not hit on ledge. Not with Roy. Yeah, does. Oh, no, 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 Roy's does it? Nope. Just prompt? Oh, okay. Learn something every day. Because quick hit. I think it's like... I think, like, I think, well, I think, I think the animation is different. It does, not, it does not hit on my doll. Okay. Well, doesn't Roy... Okay, that's kind of slow, but doesn't Roy do should be on the hit by Shanks? Yes. Yes, it does. Like, as I say... Oh. Like, every time I say something, it happens. It's scared, yeah. Commentator's curse. Okay, uh... Nah, I'm gonna hold my camera for now. Well, tell us what you want to happen then in this in the set. See what happens. I want to see your snake because I like snake more than one. Oh, good. You, oh, you jinx, and now he's only gonna go Roy. <laughs> yeah. Damn. I like that. Maybe the opposite will happen this time. I know there's a, a, a lot of like poking yeah, around, know. like just in front, like from from Pion Man 2. Sorry. Sorry, Asterisk Pion Man 2, I should say. That's, um, like, a, that's like a 2000. One internet name. That's this is a trash tag. That's, that's what you're saying. Well, that's better. That's better. That's better. Tag of like tag. I hate tag. Well, okay, he tried to catch the roll this time, but Venom Fang knowing what he got hit by in game one. Oh, nice. that was a back here. That was gonna be that. What was that? Those are gonna be the cola back here, the downer back here. One more game, and Frame wins it. Yeah. I'm pretty sure Benefang can be a soul carry though. I don't think I ever see him switch. 
I don't. I don't see him switching either. No, I don't see him. No, I don't. I don't see Reaper too. He, he knows turn off the game. I'd like to say that Venipeg is a awesome tag. <laughs> yeah, it's very unique. Much better than Asterix, Asterix P on Man Two. <laughs> what? What is it? So, I don't wanna... Lars, so Lars in chat is saying that that uh, Venipeg might go Banjo or Richter or, or like Richter. Right? He has a Banjo. I doubt it. Ready? Yeah. No way. Yeah. No. no way. Don't go. Don't go Belmont versus Roy. That's not a good idea. <laughs> yep. Nah. Stick with what you know. Yeah, this is like what we were talking about before. I think that your best plan is to go into a set with like, a plan. I think better plan plan is this carry. Alright, not too so bad. 38 versus 6. Terry, I didn't Terry. Especially like high level. Terry oh. struggle. Oh no. Wait. Interesting, interesting. I think. What armor taking it? I don't think what armor is I was gonna say Terry struggles with disjoints and then great best deed, so. Great, I also great 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 good Jer. Red Pig is so good with Cover Breaker Terry. Uh, the one thing with uh, with Ben uh, with Terry's recovery is that a lot of Terry's don't do, which makes his recovery the same force to do what Ben of is doing, which is recovery from like do a power dump right away. It's kind of hard to challenge him if you do it right away. Yeah, like, I love Terry. Big knuckle. Yeah, big knuckle. It's nice. Good luck, Joel. Tonight, now he's carrying a no momentum. Very good. Ooh, now he's carrying a no momentum nice, yeah. from Bob Madison. Because that's Ben I'm very glad that Ben yeah. stayed Terry. Me too. Me too. Because it's so easy to like, man, my Terry's not working, you know. Let me switch, right? But, but it was like, like great. Okay, I mean, I don't know if he's not working. I think it's great. Kill guy. These rolls gotta go. Yeah. They've been getting caught. Okay, he's getting catched catch the bank off his armor, right? Good job, Jeff Hardy. It's only when we're seeing a reverse of game one. So, Benefit is gonna want to hold on to the stock no matter what, just to get in Grave's head. He's. I don't want to say he's gotten to the bank, so I'm going to the king chip. Um, oh, good jump nice on there. Nice hammer cover. Simi jumps. Yeah. And avoid fall on that one. That's just... Oh, no, okay. no. Good That's DI. like screw attack doesn't kill. You know the DI would kill. Ooh. And... Oh, Look at that turnaround. It went from a 3 stock oh, game 1, a close game 2, and now a 3 stock game 3. Well, I'm going to... Grape did SD at the start there, but he didn't he didn't manage to make any stocks hey, on that one. Oh yeah. A three stock is a three stock. We don't Okay, I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying Grape also meant him early on and he could I'm recover from it. From my chair. That power zone is making me fall off my chair now. I just okay, I don't, fell don't that way. That's the danger zone. You don't want to be in that zone versus Venifang. You don't want to jump you don't want to jump when Terry has power I'm pretty sure I don't know if he has a sour spot. Like he hits you from the top but you still die. Yes. You die earlier off the top. Exactly. Like, it's just such a threatening anti here. It might be the best anti here in the game. It's just, it's so big, it's so disjointed. It catches top platforms on the battlefield and Yoshi's. Let's see. I'm, I'm assuming Grape's gonna stick with Roy. I don't think he's gonna change. What? Yo, do we got mocks on comms now? Mox. Fox move me. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so uh, uh, welcome, welcome. Place? Yo, we got oh, Great done, versus man. Venom thing. You mean Peen Man too? I mean Snake God, Great. Aster, I mean, Aster, 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 Peen Man too. Aster, yeah, Aster, Peen Man where's, too. Where's Peen Man, man 1? Uh, he, game he, four. he ate Peen Man 1. He absorbed his powers. The the game four, four, I'm making the war right now. I'm making the war right now. What is that down here? I've never seen him that before. I've never seen him go for a downer that's in the opposite direction of upper. I wonder if he's using C stick or A now button. I'm curious if anything's gonna buy the momentum ball. we had from last game. Because I think Grape's gonna want to take it back. Oh, what was that? Uh, Grape only needs one game. That should have been that should have been stuck right there. Oh. <laughs> oh man, I need water. Don't forget to say hi Terry Lid. That's a joke. Oh, nice hard nose for me. Grape started panic air dodging more, I think it's positive. 
That's what I killed? Yes. Oh, we, we didn't hear the KO scream. That's the best one in the game. <laughs> oh, someone just grabbed Ray Chase by the ball. He goes, <laughs> Like that. I mean, I, I cannot do it to the levels of Roy. Not okay. I will only do it if more people Roll, sub to our channel. Yes. <laughs> Benefit, stop rolling. That's, that's not gonna make me No. Yeah. There goes his lead. Even game. I have a team and for recognizing them. Nice dude. I wanna see Grip catch up to that now because Benefit caught the hit. We'll see it happen. Reverse happen. Tank up. Nice. Just waiting for LP. Just thinking, staying aware of Crash you. Yeah, it's what, where you want to be against a carry, right outside their burst range. Which is pretty well, where you want to be with every character is right outside their burst range. And you got to know which, where their burst range is for each character. Yes. Oh yeah, see, they wear it. The void is not going to punish it for that range properly. <laughs> Good puts to win. I think I think he just finds something so close. Oh, that's oh, no, that's trying to do it. That's good job recognizing he wants to go to ledge. Or I'm also not. glad that great. I'm also glad that great did not kind of counter. He probably went by for it. Very good. Oh, cool. Oh. Great looking a little shook, but a not quite. A little piece of gear. Oh, never okay, mind. No, no one cares. Perfect again. Sorry, Ben and Bang. <laughs> Oh wow. Oh, 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 in there. Once again, even game. Okay, just, they were just going, like, I, I, will, I will think Grip understood what was going on. I, I think he got the wrong script. I, I think he thought they were doing like, like a staring competition because he just stood there. These guys need guns. Guns? They need to do a Mexican standoff. Yeah. <laughs> they were just looking at each other from across the stage and one of them just decided to uh, pull right, Jerry just pulls first. out a gun. Carry this. Yeah. <laughs> That's how you buff Terry, just give him an, an AK-47, honestly. <laughs> just neutral B, AK-47. <laughs> Anyways. Oh. Anyways. Just gonna say, let me for Grape. Okay, now we're going to game five. I wonder if Grape's gonna sacrifice okay. or risk uh, a reset. I'll bet you if he loses this set, uh, he'll go snake. Yeah, I think so too. I think we'll stick with Roy for this to see if he learned. He, he almost had that. Yeah, I think he should and stick then with Roy. If he switches, he'll go snake. Yeah, he probably, I, he probably I, like I, try I, it. I, get I, the coffee. He has a, another whole set to um, take what he learned from a Bender Fang with Roy and apply it to a snake. I agree. That that would be the best plan. Mm -hmm. I wonder what the stages will change too. They wasn't mostly maybe, playing, they, just don't, they only play on PS2 and Smash Bros. so far. Maybe he just wants to call it and you know call it a day. Yeah, he's pretty tired. I <laughs> thirty. Who knows? Honestly, Ben Fang has had a lot of close matches in this set, so like he's definitely more tired than than P and Man Two is. But, Sorry, but the thing is, he doesn't, he doesn't lose any confidence. He just keeps going. Yeah, he's, like nothing, nothing seems to phase him. He's more fired up. Ben Fang is a yeah. grinder. He motivate. He gets motivated. I think the only time or, that momentum is, is bad is when you come right off a loss. Oh, for I mean, sure. It's significantly yeah. worse when you come right off a loss. Like, Especially uh... Especially losing at, a close game 5, and then you, someone tells you, come play your losers match. You're still mauling about your close game 5, and then you're just like, ah, I don't want to play this right now. It's like a, a Smash Con, I remember Zachary and McKay Leo's that last hit, last thought. Zachary, like, collapsed on the floor for a kid, and he got through by light afterwards. Oh, there's a snake. Yeah, like, imagine... Being composed yeah. after a moment like that. There's like, definitely a mental game here. Just no Even way. Leo just like doesn't get stone faced by anything. But anyways, game five. Game five snake. of the Grand Final set one. Snake. Grape snake coming out. I thought we're saying that. Snake. God, snakes, snakes don't eat grapes. <laughs> don't sleep. His his grenade control is very good. He knows exactly what he's already doing. Already C4 now. I see it. You see, he already put up a wall here. Yeah, That's already. He's, 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 okay, you want to come over here? You gotta get past all these first. <laughs> this looks like a button check. Oh this looks like a bullet hell. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not lying. Benefang's like great. Yeah, yeah. Benefang wants to, it's a fair once again, just crack you. Oh god. Yeah, this is gonna be uh, a bit oh. rough for Benefang, I think. We might be able to do it still. Okay, there we go. When Benefang gets in, he's gonna do a lot of damage, but. Yeah. But Snake's gonna do a really good job keeping him out. 
Alright, be careful going for Nikitas, because if you miss... Oh, I don't know, because Nikita has been laggy on Snake's end. It is, but not when you're that far away. It's no that's real true, way. that's true. Uh, I'm just thinking of watching Venom Tank is doing a lot of Smash 4, where you just want to run up shield. You kind of need to versus Snake, these grenades are going to be a big trouble. Yeah. <laughs> Crouch that cat. Snake the turtle. Yeah, Snake's crouch is insane. Well, I'm pretty sure it's the lowest in the game. He just goes all the way to the ground. Yeah. Well, I, li I like the B-reverse grenades from the uh, grape. Very, very nice stuff. Oh, Nikita yeah, saying is on point. Oh, oh, nice there. Oh, okay. okay. Support. Oh, I think it's afraid of nothing. Like, it's something up to the ghost. Oh, my grape. I... I can't even commentate, it's just so many explosions oh on my screen. Yeah, I can make an really obvious Michael Bay joke, but that's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, that was a huge combo. Yeah, that was super ten percent back here. I don't know who went back here. Quite tough for Benefic right now. Grief is complete uh, mastery of, of his character. Kind of hurt to watch this Michael Bay. Yeah, that's why I love watching two two character masters going at it. Oh jeez. Yeah. Yeah, complete master is the character right here. Yeah, as, Venom, as a, a great pick watch us out, before Venom Pan can get a reset, I think so. Nice way parry. Parry to make grenades. Yeah, nice are very hard to parry. Imagine knowing the timing of those and getting it oh, I, I think it's, from the pipe from the I'm pretty sure they explode at 2 seconds. Yeah, it's like, I think it's 2.5. It might be 2. 2.5, yeah, you're right. I think Venom Pan can get a stock here at least. Yeah, I think so Snake's too. Pretty, Snake is lighter than Terry, but he's still pretty heavy. <laughs> stock. That's, that's what we're hoping for. We're yes, for sir. Him. I'm sure he is too. Back, we'll a fight. Oh, yeah, he's a brawler. Oh, right, that, yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, oh you wanted the flash. Go for some sauce. He has some room to play with. He doesn't have, 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 have two. Terry doesn't have go, so he can't hit with hard guys right yet. And I think pretty sure Ingrid definitely aware of that. Oh. Oh, weird foot's still weird. Oh, scary. Frame one great pull. I should do That's it. Dead there we go. Yeah. There's it. There's his new one star. Right, if you can start. Get... No. Oh. He's okay. He's okay. No. <laughs> Just kicks. <laughs> All right, guys. Did you ask for Spear Man two? Totally got great. Yeah. They got great. They killed Spear Man one. And Don't, sleep. The Don't sleep. Don't sleep. Don't sleep on Spear Man. Man. Don't sleep. Thanks. GG's guys. That was a great, great, finish. great finish. Okay, one more shout out to our friends, the York University Student Center. We miss you. I'm gonna wait for. There it is. Okay, shout outs to our friends from York University Student Center. They provide us with prize pool of one hundred dollars for York U students, which will be going to Venom Fang, me, and who else made it? Um, Marianne. Marianne. There we go. There's our top three York U students. And the top three placing players are Grape, aka Peon Man 2, Venom Fang, and Choco Joe. Let's get a ride. All right, so Snake God Grape and, <laughs> <laughs> and Venom Fang and Choco Joe. So congrats to everyone. Thank you for coming out. This has been really fun. And uh, we'll agree. be back again next month at the end of March. Yes, All right. Sir. Well, good night, everyone. Good night. Thank you for good everything. Night. See you guys later. GGS. GGS.